Okay. Welcome, everyone. This is a dire, serious stream. We've got uh, some really awful news to break to you. I'm sorry. The news is Cobra is in a coma. It's serious. It's really serious, you guys. Cobra is in a coma. Now, we have a feed of, of him in his uh, hospital uh, love seat. And he's resting comfortably, okay? He's, he's A-OK. -okay. Don't fret. Don't worry. He's going to be all right. We just need to give him lots of praises, a lot of encouragement, and maybe, just maybe, he'll wake up. All right? So we're going to open up those lines, and <laughs> we're going to take some calls from people who are most definitely going to give Cobra lots of encouragement. I want to let you know that I'm taking a pledge tonight to not drink anything. Uh, let this be a lesson. Cobra, he had a wild night, friends. He ate two dozen eggs, drank some dog medicine, thinking it was 99 proof bananas, and then topped it off with a bag of ZZ Quill. Cobra's in a coma. All right? It's, it's not looking good. So let's take some calls. I'm going to give you guys a view of our brave dark warrior. There he is, you guys. He's resting comfortably right now. I, I know it's a rough look. He doesn't look good. It breaks my heart just looking at him like this. But stay strong, fellow Cobros. I had a burp start to come up just then. <clears throat> Let me fix chat. Chat is always broken at the beginning of the stream. It'll only take me a second, and we'll take some calls. Thoughts and prayers, okay? Look at him. He's in bad shape. He's not looking good. He needs help. It's serious. All right, let me open up the lines. We're getting voicemails already, I'm sorry. Going to my settings here. All right, the lines are open. Open the floodgates. Let's get some encouragement for Cobra to wake the hell up. Cobra's Thoughts and Prayers Hotline, yes. Oh my God, oh my God, it's... Holy shit. Yes. Hey, I just heard about my boy. I know. It's it's dire. This is a serious situation. Look at him. I I know. I'm I'm looking at the screen right now, dude. This is so fucked. Look at the state Listen, of I've our got boy. my wand. I've got I've got my Cobra Craft wand in my hand. Okay. I'm holding it. I'm holding it like Josh with like hold the you know tightly. the weird finger thing that he does. You're thinking good. No, no, I gotta hold it like my my gothic dark lord. I've gotta oh, hold it with yeah. the weird finger thing that he does. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> he holds it. You know, he's got it extended out with the index finger on it. Yeah. Are you waggling it? No, I'm waving it around. I'm 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 drawing all kinds of circles with it. Oh, making all kinds of shapes. Good, good. Can you make? Yeah, a I've I've just made a bunch of green chi balls. Can you I'll make, make a, a green stuzzy? key heart. Yeah, I've you know, and this you know this wand is really powerful. Yeah. Because uh I found uh a bunch of bogs from his chair uh -huh. encased in resinous mountain dew, and he used that as a gemstone on the wand. Ooh, resinous mountain dew. Now that's an ingredient. You could boil it down and turn it into a resin, couldn't you? Oh my god, I could I could turn it back into mountain dew. You turn. Like, <laughs> you can rehydrate right. back in. Yeah, I just rehydrate it, bud. Yeah. Just put the water back in it, you know. And then I put some, you know. And then I just use that as a marinade in a crock pot with some pork ribs. 
Oh yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Do you mm. like pork ribs? I love pork ribs. Thanks for asking. Yeah, I'm you know, I'm happy to ask. Josh doesn't like it when you ask that anymore. Oh, <laughs> he's a little sensitive about that, huh? I think so. Some kind of I couldn't imagine why that he he's not in on yet. It just confuses the body. I, I, I think he's him. finally, I, I think it took him about 50 tries, but I think he's finally catching up on the fact that it's a troll question. Oh, you know, I got to admit, I, uh, I don't think I would understand. I mean, it, it, w w there's no deeper meaning to it, is there? Unless I'm missing something. No, I think it's just the fact that he made that those pork ribs once and they were, you know. They're okay. They were made by Josh and then. It's just a, it's just a thing that the trolls just keep asking him, and he just has. I, I guess he's finally picked up on it. Cook I don't think there's any pasta. deeper meaning to it, really. Yeah, cook them. Uh, well, you know, them. our boy. Yeah. Our boy. I'm I'm really you know I'm really hoping though that when he finally wakes up from this coma, he's got plenty of egg scum left on the bottom of his pot for boiling, so he can flavor his pasta with that. That's the good stuff. That's what you hang on to afterward. Hang on to that. Oh yeah. I, yeah, he needs to leave that pot sitting around for at least, you know, at least a week. I like to dip my toast in it. Just like bacon grease, you just, you dip your toast in there, you get that egg scum. Mmm. 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 Mm -mm. mm. Oh, man. Why we, why, you, and, you and Josh should do a cooking show. Yeah, pfft. Yeah, yeah, do that I thing wish. like uh, what, what Snoop Dogg and Martha Stewart started doing. Yeah, well, I may as well team up with Bobby Flay while I'm at it, right? I'm not that talented. Hell yeah. Maybe if I keep at it, I'll have his cooking skills, but not yet. Man. Well, you know, I'm really glad I got this. I got this wand from Josh. I'm praising our Dark Lord in his magic with all my heart. I'm sending him lots of chi and energy and various other miscellaneous things mm, yes i think he, um, i think he's feeling it right now i i think i saw something I, just then yeah i think yeah i thought i i thought i saw something so i i blessings upon our gothic dark lord and yes, yes. uh very Thank important you. i think there's a very special somebody with a, a snaggle tooth and a lazy eye and a bowl cut oh who, he's around here somewhere believe me yeah he's been tormenting i feel like hearing his yeah, I feel like his 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 voice will will surely rouse the Dark Lord. Oh, he's coming! You better believe it. I'm terrified. Hell yeah! Well, much love to you, Caesar. Much love to the community, man. It's, it's always a ride. Every, something new every week. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Don't know what you're gonna get. Cobra's blessings. All right, thanks, Bye man. Now. Peace out. Mm. Thoughts and prayers. Oh yes. my god. Yeah. So I saw I saw our boy. He's unconscious. Um, He's not doing know, think, too hot right now. Mm -mm. I think I think I know what we need. I've been oh, cooking up some special it. smelling salts. Oh yeah. Now, yeah. His senses He's had so much spice. He's had so much alcohol. Ordinary ammonia won't do it. So I've been grinding up some bacon, extra thick cut apple wood. Oh, it's yeah. It's got extra mushrooms. It's got extra sausage. It's oh, got yeah. cheddar cheese. Yes, please. It's yes, got please. bacon. Speaking my lingo, Ringo. I'm going to get up right next to the screen. I'm going to crack it right under his nose. Here we go. Okay. Okay. It's, you should wake up any minute. Are you waffling? I don't know why it's not working. Make sure to waffle. I'm, I'm wafting it. I'm okay. wafting it, but um, Never I don't understand. Waffle. You need what, to you know? waffle it. A waffle it. Okay. Yeah, you got to let it waffle. All right, I'm waffling. Okay. Now, if it seeps into your computer monitor screen, it should travel through the bandwidth into his pit. It just takes time. It, yeah, it should. I mean, every time he offers me a bite through the screen, I, I open up my mouth and I take one <laughs> and I taste that juicy burger. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you know, thank you for bringing that positive energy. I love it when he tells me to take a bite. Oh, I know. I mean, it looks so good, but the cross section gives so you every good. sweet ingredient. Yeah, it looks so good. Take a bite. Take a bite. Take a bite. Take a bite.
drinking coffee tonight. Hey, you want to take a bite? Oh, yeah, this is a seizure robot. Oh, yeah. <laughs> is this Mr. Oh, Bone? This- this is Lamar Bone of Boston Elementary School. <laughs> and and uh, I've got a bone to pick with you about that George oh. Bray Saunders. <laughs> and you got a bad kid. What is he, your son? A uh, person? No, 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 no. You got no, some, no, 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 you got some no, bad referring... seed, Mr. Bone. Percy, he said no, he's going to no, cream no. me. He's going to cream no, you me. Listen to me. No, you listen to me, young man. I will not uh-huh. hear him with my, my nephew, Percy Finger. Oh, yeah. he's a good little boy. Now, as a matter of fact, I've got a problem because uh, that Joshua Faye Saunders, he's been coming around here trying to mess with our non of age girls at the elementary school. Yeah. Well, uh, Percy came home one day, and I swear to God, he had him a stick, a painted stick, and I said, Percy, Percy, what, what the hell is this you've got here? And Percy told me, well, it's a magic wand, Uncle Lamar. And I said, well, Percy, what did you have to do to get this? And he said, you had to have sex, anal sex, with a gothic fire boy. Oh. And I went and found this boy, and I told him, don't you ever Percy, mess no. with my... Don't you ever mess with my nephew, Percy, again. <laughs> oh, what? <laughs> what did... What did Mr. Dink have to say about this? I'm sure this had well, a very uh, concern. Well, I remember Bud Dink told me that he did indeed call the same number because he had that one of them uh, anti-rape t-shirts. <laughs> I'm sorry. I, can't I, don't, focus. I do not think this is humorous, young man. Oh, it's not. It's not funny. I'm sorry. What? Oh. That's a man. Percy! Percy is terrible. Oh. What is it, Uncle Lamar? Oh no, Percy! <laughs> <laughs> well, I was about to eat some cream clots. And, uh, yeah. <laughs> and, uh, this hot gothic fat boy told me he'd give me a magic wand if he helped me in his dry spell. Oh, yeah. So, what'd you do, Percy? You cream him? Oh, well, I'm the one who got cream seizure. Oh. Oh. <laughs> I'm sorry to hear that, Percy. Oh, everyone's getting creamed. Oh. It, 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 is, it is a shame what's happening in here. Uh, apparently, uh, well, well, well I, won't, I won't hold you too long, seizure. But, uh, no worries, Mr. Bowen. I've, I've Come heard, back anytime. I've heard that he has some music. He's got himself a music career. Oh, yeah, yeah. He's I, very successful. I, I was, I was li- uh, now, I was listening to that young man's music, and it's nothing but a bunch of uh, higgly biggly. Oh, higgly biggly, yeah. Well, I mean, compared to what uh, Doug was up to, you know, banging on a trash can and stuff, uh, uh it's the same vein, he, similar. He, he sure, if, if he really wanted to become successful, see, see, I'm going to let you go, Mr. Bone. Thanks for the laughs. All right, well, you have yourself a good day. I'm, I'm going to go apply some preparation to H.O. Percy. <laughs> 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 oh, oh! <laughs> Fuck me! I was trying to get. I have the. I have the yodel theme around here somewhere. I almost had it, but uh, did not get it in time. I did have Percy's theme up. Hopefully, that was coming through nice and strong, without overpowering Mr. Bone. Oh, well done. Mr. Bone coming in hot. Ugh. Yeah, okay, bro, says Lucky Went Live Boy. My of-age wife, Walnut, was dry until you came on. Mm. Keep that walnut good and slick. Yes. 
Hello, this is Alabaster Slim, and I just I want to pull the plug, from Josh. Alabaster? No, no. Let's just let's just pull the plug. Mm-mm. I don't think so. Look at him. He's still a healthy young man. He has so much left to give the world. I don't know. Uh, it save electricity. Yeah, he could. With that electricity, <laughs> we could power a small fan. Probably could. Yeah, yeah, but. How dare you? How dare you bring that negative energy? In fact, I, I think I can... Something something is going wrong. If if you... Oh, oh no. Just pull the plug. No! No, we're not going to pull the plug. Look what you're doing to him. You are... You're, oh, God, he's so sick. He's so sick. You've got you to gotta stop this. No. No, you stop that right now. Say you're sorry this no, instant. No, let four plug no we're not. Mm-mm, no, we're not pulling the plug. We need some positive energy stacked. Someone's got to save our boy. He's not well. He's sick. He's hurting. He's hurting. Help. Help. Are dying? Dying. We need a call it quick. Hello? Hey, Coca Cola's Hello? not well. We need, he needs a reason to live. Stat. He's hurting. He's hurting. Our boy's not well. I'm, I'm just so scared that I don't have to lose. Give him a reason to live. What I've done is Yes, yes, that's right. You need closure. You need forgiveness. Uh, ask for the forgiveness quick. Okay, my friend. I need forgiveness. I need forgiveness. Oh, shit. I need forgiveness. I need forgiveness. Yeah. I'm afraid that he won't get his bond. I need forgiveness. For his birthday. Oh, yes, yes. Okay. I'll tell you what. All right. He settled down. He's okay. He's okay. 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 All right. So you're... You want, were you looking for a blessing? A blessing of forgiveness. Okay, all right. So in our Lord's stead, let me calm down for a second, all right? Okay. Oh, God. You need forgiveness for donating during the DTTS saga. Yeah, I was pretending to be cool taste and talking shit. I'm afraid they won't be friends anymore. Oh, no, they need to be friends on this special day. Cool Taste birthday. They're supposed to collab together, don't you know? Well, I'm just afraid if I don't get forgiveness, they won't. All right. So do you have any, uh, do you actually have any tactical soap? I don't. I only have small little pieces I've been saving for three months. All right. So what I think you need to do So you need to open up your PayPal. Okay. All right. I need you to make a pretty sizable donation to Cobra because that, believe me, that will perk him right up. He knows when he gets money to the PayPal. Three euros, though, and he doesn't understand what European money is. Oh, it's not bad. I mean, when you convert that to USD, he could get some shooters to break his teeth on. No problem. I think that uh, that would help out. I think I'll just send him Bitcoin for my my Bitcoin collection. I think I think he can use that pretty well to get. Is it one of more. the physical Bitcoins? Well, you no, know, it's all just digital. But I think he can get enough Dow rods. Yeah. Etsy to at least make enough to buy Bird Dog Peach whiskey. Excellent, excellent. I was going to say as well with the um, Bond Tactical Soap with those slivers. Do you have a cheese grater? I do. I need you to use that to create a fine dust, like really, really fine. And uh, I need you to either garnish your favorite Cobra combination with that or uh, just rub it all over yourself. But uh, Can can I mix it with my spice and smoke it? Oh, perfect. Perfect. Oh, thank God. Attaboy. Well... That's I'm going to need tough. you to get right on that, okay? What was that? One more time? Uh, praise Cobra's magic. I so much better. Praise Cobra's magic. He's feeling better, too. That was a close call. Thank oh you. 
Cobra's blessings. Huh? Bye now. Mm. He's coming back to life. Yep. <laughs> he is alive and well, friends. Praise Cobra's magic. Hey, yo, is that my boy Cesar? Yeah, speaking. I uh, just want to let you know that um, I'm sorry to hear that Cobra's actually in a coma. Um, Cobra's in a coma. I tried to finish him off. I was uh, busy with Stephanie. He came in. Um, I had to just give him a quick one, too. Um, I thought he was done for, but it looks like he's, he's coming back alive. Um, Did you put uh, him to you sleep? Nick Cobra, can you like take like a monster energy drink out for him? Like, just tell him I'm sorry. Um, you know, I didn't want him to see me with Stephanie there. I know that's his ex-girlfriend. Um, well, now, hang on one anyway. minute, mister. Hold the phone. Yeah. Uh, Mr. Stallone. Who yeah. is this again? Tyrone. Tyrone. Oh. Is this yeah. Tyrone Biggums? Um, yeah. Yeah, you know, uh, some a little bit, you know, that, that sticky green, you know, that, that good stuff, you know, but he yeah. likes the spice. He likes the spice. I get that from the gas station. I double the price for him. You know, sometimes I give him, uh, you know, one and a half, you know, a little bit of, a little bit of spice, a little extra for him, but, uh, you know, Seeing me with Stephanie really caught him up, you know, so I had to uh, talk to her, uh, her family, and um, he knows them very well. So it's all good now. Um, they're just glad he's not hanging out there anymore. Um, no. The wind has really died down. The wind's um, anyways, dying down. Anyways, my, uh, my 21 and below, uh, of age, clean, consenting uh, female here, so I'm going to have to attend to her needs. Um, uh, TWU, and keep it fucking going. That's right. Don't let him insult you again. I, I think... I, oh, okay. He went quick. Hang in there, Cobra. Oh, he's fighting. He is fighting. Ooh. Truly blessed. Hello. Mm. Hello. Ooh, hey, who's this? I'm sorry. This is serious. This is serious. Let me, let me, uh, can we, can we reset the mood here? Can we start fresh? Cobra's yeah. Blessings Hotline. Praise Cobra's Magic. A circle of healing upon our Dark Lord. Who is this? Fangirl Daisy. Fangirl <laughs> Daisy! From the basement. Yeah. You done it again. Hey, <laughs> uh, serious question. Did, did you get in contact with our Dark Lord just the other night? Yeah, um, I've been talking to him on Discord. What are you up to, Daisy? <laughs> Just trying to video chat the dude. Yeah, I think you're scheming something. You have some powers. You no, casting I'm spells? Not actually, I'm not a troll or anything. I'm actually pretty uh, nice to him. Okay, as long as you stay sweet. You gotta stay sweet, okay? Now... <laughs> Fair warning, uh, he has a terrible habit of sending unsolicited dick pics. Are you ready for that? I have unfortunately seen them on Discord. I do not need, I do not need to see it anymore. <laughs> oh, no. The baby didn't see it, right? No. Oh, my God. Hey, can you describe it to me? I'm good. I don't even want to think of it. Oh, yeah. You're up to no good. You got some powers, Daisy. I'll say it every time. I don't know how you do it. I got people begging me to call them so they don't have to get in. We got Daisy coming in hot every night, looking at Cobra's dick, baby in the background. Mm. There, yep, yep. Listen, don't let that baby see Cobra's penis, okay? He praises Cobra's magic, boy. Now, sooner or later, you and I got to talk because I want to know what you are up to. You're talking to, to Cobra direct. And usually that oh, means there's a scheme involved. He sent private videos when I gave birth to my baby. Wait, um, he what? shouted out, uh, he shouted out my Felix, like my baby boy Felix. Um, like my, when I was my in my baby boy. Yeah. Yeah, because my boyfriend had texted him and said, "Oh, she just gave birth and stuff." So he sent a private video of him saying, like, you know, congrats and all that. You gonna share that at some point? Uh, 
I feel like that's more of a private thing since it's kind of directed towards me and my child and shit. Oh, uh, I understand. I understand. Just because that'd be a little bit weird to like put on the Reddit or some shit, you know? And then that, that would also probably sense. make folks feel really weird. Well, I don't know. I'm getting a little suspicious of you, Daisy. I want to know what this big scheme is. You can't tell, but he's <laughs> listening. He's listening right now. So careful what you say. Praise Cobra's magic. Did he bless your <laughs> child? Did he bless your baby? Yeah. Damn, no wonder you got so many powers. Okay. <laughs> well, congrats again. I got to say, pardon me. Um, oh, my. <coughs> oh. <coughs> Dying. I'm not going to make smoke. it. Uh, yeah, you got some dedication. I, I admire you. Uh, you're able to get in here. You're able to get into Cobra's ear. You have powers. I, I think you are casting spells on the side from your basement lair. I'm on to you, okay? I've got one okay. wonky eye on you, Daisy. One wonky? I thought it was two wonky. Uh, the other one's occupied. I'm keeping one wonky eye. <laughs> All right, say goodnight. All right. Unbelievable. GF Cat says, Seizure, we need 50 cc's of donation injected directly into Josh's PayPal stat. Put this directly in his account. Hello there. Oh, hey. Wendy. Wendy. Did I get through there? Oh, jeez. Oh, yeah, ever, I'm so Wendy. happy to be here. You know, your podcast goes harder than a cat trying to bury a turd on a linoleum floor. How are you? Oh, I'm doing great. It is, uh, it is a task just to keep up with you. You go so quick. You got a mouth on you. Oh, jeez. Yeah, I'm like a hummingbird in a hurry every day. Jeez. <laughs> yeah. Wendy, I was doing some research on you the other night. Where you? <laughs> yeah, I was trying to figure you out because you're a real treat. And uh, <laughs> I wanted to see if there's any trace of you on the internet. Have you been contributing to the Urban Dictionary? I have very now, yeah, buddy. There was something about putting Tupperware in an oven. Can you remind me? Yeah, that's the white trash welfare check. A lot of people <laughs> likes to store their uh, they like to store their wares in the oven because they don't cook too much. So you yeah, gotta check before they put something in the oven so they don't burn a house down. That's the white trash welfare check. Yeah, it's real oh, important to do. Yeah. Save yeah. lives. I'm like you know, Colts right now. He's in a real serious condition. Jeez Louise. <laughs> Jeez Louise. <laughs> I'm gonna I'm gonna yeah. turn you down the slightest bit just because historically, when I've been listening to the audio, you are. Wow, you got some pipes on you, Wendy. Yeah, really, you can really coming in strong. Coming in real strong, Wendy. Yeah. You got any other uh, any other wonderful phrases for us? Any other things you've been contributing? There was um there was one in there. It was pretty dark. Uh, Hell in, yeah. Yeah. Was that you too? <laughs> a Canadian farewell is the most polite way to you know you know pull a pro gamer move. You know you take care of all your affairs before you sign off. So you're you not know, a bother, just, right? Uh, yeah, exactly. Yeah. yeah so I, yeah. Uh, I contributed that as well. You know, most polite way to go out. You are <laughs> prolific, aren't you? Yeah. I, uh, I had a few questions for you. If you had uh, some time before the cool taste impression contest. <laughs> That's my favorite part of the night. Let me tell you, I DVR it. I always play every, it back all the time. Every week is cool taste impressions night. Yeah. Yeah. Well, let's hear it. I want to hear them. Uh, so I was curious, you know, uh, George's an American, so something visit like that's going to cost him a cool 150 k plus tax and tip. So, uh, you know, <laughs> after a kind of kind of event like that, a health scare, do you think that George would change his behavior in any way or would it go back to the, you know, up, the, the eviction saga where he just has this smug look on his face like didn't die? You know, do you think he'll actually change his behavior and shape up? Or do you think if he actually did have a real big health scare, he'd just go back to the same old stuff? Ooh, so I, I, I think we're, we're talking serious, right? We're putting it all on the table. Yeah, like something where, yeah, he'd have to, like I said, it'd be worth a cool 150K. You know, something where he goes, yeah, geez, I don't think I can, you know, Google my way out of this. Ooh. I think that's, that's a really good question. Cobra so far has indicated that he's not afraid of death. 
but he hasn't quite had a brush with it yet, right? Yeah. And to really get close to dying and have his organs fail or, or fall into a cobra, I'm sorry, a cobra, like he has now, <laughs> uh, ooh, I would lean towards him stopping for a while and then falling back into old habits and finding a justification for it. That's, that's the most real response answer. I, I, I think that's actually true. I've seen a few people and, you know, they maybe shape up for a bit. Like, you know, when he got the call from Clint, oh, I'll stop smoking inside. I'll stop drinking for now. And yeah. they just really, they go back to old habits real fast. So I think you're right with that one. Um, I had like another question if you had the time. Oh, I do. Always got time for you, Wendy, baby. Ah, uh, jeez. Yeah. yeah. I, uh, flattery will get you everywhere, Caesar. Oh. I, uh, my question was about your artistic process, you know. Mm, art like the Cobra Cat? Art yeah. yeah. Well, no, I've been having the Cobra Captain blog lately, just watching his old <laughs> stuff. It's a, <laughs> it's a self-enforced yeah. hell that I've trapped myself in and I can't escape. But, uh, yeah. I, uh, yeah. I was wondering... <laughs> You know, art's a little bit of a monster. You know, you create it and you let it loose on the world and you really don't have control of it after that. You put it on the internet, it's forever, you know? Mm. And when I was younger, I was writing some stories on the internet and my grandfather sent me an email. He said, oh, that's real good writings. I go, that wasn't for you, you know? So did you ever have somebody <laughs> peer behind the curtain that wasn't supposed to see? You know, did you ever let your art loose into the world and it kind of bled over to your personal life or someone in your family saw and you were a wee bit embarrassed, you know? Did you ever have something like that? I don't want my parents to know what I do that they don't want to know either. I was showing them some CG I made and they went, mm, yeah. Mm, uh -huh, mm, yeah. Uh -huh, mm. And they were not interested. So fortunately <laughs> That's I've got better a than being too interested. Cause to explain to your grandfather, why you're writing that kind of fan fiction, let me tell you a conversation you don't want to have. Yeah. Yeah. I think when I was younger, I'm trying to think of all the stuff that I, I used to put together, artwork and stuff. Um, you know, they really did not have a lot of interest. So I didn't have a lot of opportunities to embarrass myself. That's a good, that's good. Yeah. Uh, and yeah. I was, I was also wondering, you know, do you have an antacid I can take with this kind of content to make it digestible? Cause I just, I really, I, I feel like I'm in the, I call it the undercooked pasta era. He's just noodling <laughs> on his guitar, just noodling nonstop. And I just, yeah. it really actually, it's just a part of my brain. I feel like I'm going a little mad. Definitely makes you appreciate the content creators much more, but I, I can't, it's, I can barely stand it. I definitely have a Cobra cap. I have to cut myself off or I want to punch a wall. So <laughs> there an acid you can suggest to make it more palatable. Oh, you need like a palate can I cleanser, do don't you? Yeah, 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 exactly. Uh, like I take a break, do something, something I can watch with this that I, it will make me, you know, less full of rage. Oh boy. I love the Rocky movies, but that's not something I like to watch <laughs> concurrently. I don't, I don't uh, simulcast those. To, mm, boy, I don't know if I would even recommend adding another lol cow to the mix. But Yeah, yeah, especially with the direction they're all going now. It's, yeah. Uh, I, I don't feel like it's a good, yeah. I'll tell you what, if you need a nice palate cleanser, are you familiar with Olalilia, a.k.a. Nick Diana. Smith? He, he is the lol uh -huh. cow that changed his life. He turned his life around. He has oh, wow. intense OCD. I heard name. Uh, he mm -hmm. used to think that blue water would kill him. He used to think he'd never <laughs> drive a car and he just gamifies everything. If you can look up, um, check out the platform master. It's a, uh, documentary that was made about him. It takes place in the Midwest. I'm sure you can appreciate that. Uh, <laughs> yeah, for sure. Give that a look. And that might put you back in the mood to go back to Cobra. Cause, uh, Olalilia is the yeah. total opposite. All right. Well, this is the Cobra Captain's Log signing off. I don't want to hold you off yeah, too much, but hey, yeah, uh, could you give a shout out to Bite Size and ask him if he has a lady friend that he hangs out with now and again there? Huh? Oh yeah, bye. Yeah, you have a caller. Yeah, bye. 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 Horse pee. Congratulations, Bite. She's a real prize. What up? Jesus. <laughs> oh, shit. Hang on, hang on. I accidentally hung up on that person. I'm going to call him back. You have reached the phone of... All right, I cut that off. I don't want to give out names. That's not good. Oh, my God, I'm so sorry. I did not mean to hang up on that one.
Ugh. I was enthralled by Wendy. I'm gonna hang on to that number. I'll try you again. Cobra's Blessings, Circle of Healing. Baglam, did I make it to the show? Uh, yeah. Who, who is this a uh, relation of Wendy? No, not really. Oh, okay. You're just doing a, a nice... Uh, I got you there, didn't little, I? Little accent. Yeah, yeah. You, you fooled me. Yeah, that's yeah. what happens when you're from the Northeast. We uh we need some encouragement for Cobra. He is starting to sink again. I can sense it. Do you have any oh. words of encouragement? Josh, I know you're doing the best you can every day. Um, I'm going to donate to your PayPal this week just oh, yeah. as soon as I get paid and as oh, soon yeah. as my mother unlocks my debit card. Oh, did uh, did you get it taken away, you bad boy? I certainly did. Well, you're just like our Dark Lord. Only gothic bad boys get their debit cards taken away. Oh, you got that right. I got that rocket long hair. Yeah. What were you spending all your money on, boy? E-cigarettes. Uh-huh. The, and... The old ones? Like the those, like, blue ones that you never see anymore? No, no. <laughs> <laughs> gotcha. All right, oh, so Jesus. you're you're addicted to the the e cigs. I I got gotcha. you. Expensive habit. The e cigs. Yeah. Uh, spending a lot of money on hot topic. I needed oh, to get a new stud yeah. belt. Yeah. And uh, some new black and green striped gloves. Oh, that sounds really cool. I think uh, it's worth getting your card taken away. It is. You can. Uh, can rock out like that green and black gloves what is cobra's best quality to you um well for me what's always stuck out is uh i think it was yeah in the second documentary when darf has his moment on camera and he's talking about how josh saved his life yeah i totally believe that josh would be like uh you know he would say the cliche shit, but it's cliche for a reason. I, I really feel like, you know, with his friends at least, he could convince them to keep it going. Yeah, we and, uh, we really need Darth Lenny tonight. If there's anyone who could say some positive things about Cobra, it is Darth Lenny. Yeah, you got that right. Maybe someone can do a Darth impression. That'd be good. No, no impressions, just Darth, okay? We know the difference. Oh, do we? Yeah. Do we, do we ever? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> no. Uh, yeah. You know, you, you could probably fool Josh, honestly. If, if it sounds enough like him, uh, I'll take it. If it can help encourage him to wake up. Yeah. I'm really waiting for this Cool Taste uh, collab video. I saw I'm excited. What do you think they're going to do together? I mean... Oh, I think it was the other night Josh said, like, uh, if I stream at a bar again... I'm not going to do it live, and I'm not going to name the place. Or he said he would do it live, but he said he wouldn't name the place. Yeah. So they might be at a bar, or it would be crazy to see Josh at the Cool Taste Lounge. The Cool Taste Lounge. That's what I'm talking about. Here's to hoping we get to see that real soon. I certainly hope so. Hey, All I right. got a question for you if you got a second. Oh, Okay. I was playing you out, just just to be transparent. What you got? Oh, I, I could tell. I could tell. <laughs> Stop me dead in my uh, tracks. Yeah. Your animations. Mmm. 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 Yes. I've been I've been a fan for a long time. Uh, this is October. I don't know if you remember we talked on Discord. Oh hell yeah! Hey man. Hey man. Yeah. Um, yeah, I was just curious about the storylines. You've been working on them. Funny you should ask. I have been working on it this week. I was getting the most recent podcast episode ready, and I almost oh. fell into an old trap where it gets delayed way too long. I'm going to make a nice, concise intro for this one, and then I think I'm going to do the most recent animation I've been working on in a separate video. Separate video? In a separate video. A whole video, video for us? Aside yeah. from the podcast? Yeah, aside from the podcast, I think it is uh, worth watching on its lonesome. Oh, I'm so ready. 
Yes. I'm glad that uh, you're a fan. I've been thinking about that. I um, was getting the the pixels ready. It's, it's pretty labor intensive, but I haven't done anything real serious with that since I think Killers 2. Right. And yeah, you're like a full-time working man, right? Oh yeah, you know it. Yeah, yeah. So just no matter what people say, don't don't ever feel pressure for like rushing shit out. You know, I'm I'm, I'm sure it takes yeah. a long time. I know, but don't let the haters and trolls keep you down. Yeah, I don't care how long I have to wait. Oh, just knowing you're doing it is great. It's it's coming. It's coming. At least I wouldn't want to slow down the podcast as a result. I think I think people get antsy when it's too long. I can't remember what my record was. But when someone made a joke that the podcast was seasonal, I knew I had to change my life, just mm-hmm. like our little Boglum here needs to change his. <laughs> you got that right. Yeah. Oh, geez. Well, thank you very much. I'm very honored to be, uh, to be a caller. Oh. And uh, I'm going to keep on listening. Keep on listening, boy. Better hey, I really hope listening. to hear from Chauncey tonight. Hell, hell yeah. Well, if need be, oh, I'll just call please, him. Please, Chauncey. <laughs> I'll get him. I'll get him. Don't worry. All right, brother. All right. See you, fool. Mm. Yeah. Who's this? Hey, Seizure. Yeah. Hi. <laughs> yeah, so... Um... Dark mm-hmm. times are upon us. And oh, very, very dark times. Thank you, Colin. Yeah. <laughs> the intention of my call today is to spread a little bit of cobra cheer. And the way I want to start off by doing that is to highlight a very uh, near and dear clip to my heart that involves uh, Cobra, Scotty, and Scotty's baby mama. Oh, yes. And, uh, <laughs> it's a fucking classic, man. These two fucking... The Subway sandwich <laughs> drama? Yeah, yeah. And, and what what makes that one so special to me, man? And I work. I put in about an eight. I put about twelve hours worth of hard labor, uh, manual labor, man. I'm I'm doing mm. what I can, and 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 these fucking degenerates are sitting <laughs> at home on a Tuesday, and you know it's about like one or two. They're reviewing, making videos, and uh, Facebook drama. I just uh, encourage anybody who hasn't seen it, yeah. to go look at it. <laughs> That's one of Chauncey's all-time favorite clips. <laughs> it's just, oh, man. Single oh, life. <laughs> Waggling his arms around, <laughs> eyes popping out of his head. Scotty leaving the room. That was uh, that was some advanced tactics coming in through the window. Right, it's it's a very famous window, right, Caesar? Because everybody talks about that they, before they go into his home, they always make a they they always stop by that window. Yeah, yeah, it's very accessible and, through that thing. Yeah, and uh, the funny thing is, is how uh, Scotty kept talking about he didn't want to talk about the drama. Yeah, and, uh, <laughs> and yet he kept exacerbating it. He was making it far worse. The, and, uh, when the girl finally comes in through the, I don't know where the fuck she, how she got in, but uh, you see Cobra doing a double take, like, oh my fucking God. Oh yeah. We well, see her shadow first. If you look closely, you can see her figure starting to come in and then he sees it. And uh, that, that mouth is wide open. When she yeah, uh, makes the assault, I don't know what you would call that, boards the apartment. Yes, all that happening in Casper, Wyoming. Oh, yeah. That's where all the excitement um, is, is uh, Cobra's uh, apartment and all his surrounding <laughs> friends. Before I get off, uh, I remember in the video it would show the messages that she was sending and she was talking about, like, Scotty, you're no good. You're not a good father. <laughs> you were never around. Yeah. And, and then you got Scotty. Oh, that's bullshit. I like. I do try. I do try. Can you stop? Can you please stop? The worst. It, worst. It, it, if you if you think about it, if you analyze that, that's that's like they haven't left uh, high school, right? Like yeah. them, their their maturity is still at high school. That's the last place I'd want to be. That that is hell on earth being between those two fighting away. Oh my god! Well, there you go. Cobra's right in the middle of it. 
Yeah. <laughs> Say, get out of my house. <laughs> All right. No more drama. <laughs> That's right. I'm sick of it. <laughs> Going blue in the face. Um, yeah, uh, that's, that's crazy. But all right, DJ, thanks for uh, another great night, another nostalgic uh, night with you. Oh, you're very welcome. Thoughts and prayers to our Lord. Hopefully he wakes the hell up. Yes, sir. All right. Catch you later. Mm. So mote it. Oh, dang it. Well, let me try that one number. Oh, too fast. Okay. I'll try it next time. So mote it be in the witch's circle. Hello. Oh, oh, you're there. All right. Yes. What's up, Seizure? Oh, not much. Trying to give some positive energy to our dark lord. He's in a coma. Yeah, fuck him. I have a question. Oh, hey now. Hey. All right. <laughs> I will answer your question, but I need you to give some positive energy to Cobra once we're done here, okay? You're hurting him. I don't him. think I can do that, man. All right, we'll, we'll cross <laughs> no, that bridge seriously. later. Yeah. So I'm not going to ask if you're a parent or anything like that, but I struggle so badly seeing Josh do what he does on a daily basis, like with drinking and everything else. <clears throat> Sorry, I have a cough. Oh, me too. With drinking worry. and everything else. Yeah. And what he, uh, just what he does to his body and how Clint doesn't intervene at all. So what do you think Clint is doing? Do you think he's just buying his time before Josh hurts himself? Like, do you think, as a lot of people say, he just kind of put him in his own corner and keeps him there? Like, what do you think is going on here? I think that it is much like the way that we kind of put away our anxieties and problems somewhere and, and let them pile up. He's just waiting for Cobra to hit critical mass until it's really serious. And, uh, pardon me, burped. Uh, I've talked about it before. What's unfortunate about Cobra is he knows how to just stay in a happy medium where he's not totally off the deep end, where it, it's super serious. He's just kind of a regular drinker, alcoholic, <clears throat> which, you know, in, in Wyoming or Casper or whatever, I've been reading a lot that uh, it's pretty ordinary for people to just drink all the time. So, um, but yeah, Clint, Clint has his own life. He's not paying attention. Um I'm sure he's going to cry and blame the trolls when Josh finally injures himself somehow or uh, has something bad happen, but he's just not paying attention. He doesn't want to think about it. Yeah, but even with my like primitive understanding of love, right? <laughs> like, I couldn't <laughs> Yeah. I couldn't see how if oh. Clint truly loves Josh, how he could be okay with like, you know, all the epic moments we've had. Let's let's just say over the last year and Clint be like, that's my son. I love him. Yeah. But I'm just, he's doing the best he can every day. You know, and, and it's just, it's really like, my, I can't wrap my head around it. My, my only answer is that the guy doesn't give a shit anymore. <laughs> and he doesn't really care about Josh, um, which is really tragic. But I, I don't know. I just, yeah, I, I know this is a question that gets asked a lot. Um, whether it's on the forum or anywhere else, but it's there's just, yeah the, uh, a certain mentality of parents that can be very destructive, and it's the the coping that they'll go through of uh, little phrases like "Oh, these guys are so jealous, that's why they're trolling him," and um, he they just want to be as successful. I know that uh, Chris Chan's dad was all about that. And I, I couldn't believe some of the stuff that was coming out of his mouth. They'll defer blame and have this really naive attitude. It came out quite a bit in his Reddit posts that he was not ready to acknowledge that Josh was being a big old dumb, dumb and, and making bad decisions. He just blames other entities. I think that's playing into this. Um, they've got to be talking right when he was coming over and they were making, 
uh, lathed wands. Josh was probably telling him bits and pieces about his life, I would hope. I mean, do you think Clint yeah, knows that he got like banned <laughs> from a couple bars at this point? He has to have. Yeah. Right? Like he's he's got to know. But also, here's an alarming little bit of information that I don't know if a lot of people caught on. But mm. uh, I, I don't know if it was Thanksgiving or Christmas, but Josh didn't go to the family's house over the holidays. Yeah, yeah. He, yeah, he, I think he said something like, I'd rather stay at home and make wands. And so there's two reasons why that would have happened, right? Either one is Josh said, I don't want to be with my family. I'd rather be drinking. Or Clint said, hey, hey boy, just stay home. You know what I mean? Like there's only two options for that. They and seem to have a either, like a mutual, sorry, I didn't mean to cut you off, like a mutual oh, no, no. understanding under the surface, if anything, that they both don't want Josh to be there. Josh doesn't want to be there and neither does Clint. <laughs> So one way or another, it's so fucking sad, man. It is sad. I can't imagine my family covertly not wanting me to to show up to a Thanksgiving because of reasons. I mean, because I stink or I don't get along with people or I'm like the weird, almost like a stepchild. You know, I'm from the other marriage. All kinds of reasons. It's depressing. Yeah really sad but i just i still can't wrap my head why around why clint doesn't do more i mean even with the eviction saga when you, i mean after everything up you even up to that point clint goes do you need counseling like you're gonna ask somebody who's severely too little too handicapped late if yeah yeah like, that's... what josh is all of a sudden gonna say yeah i need it dad you know but that's clint's strategy and action is keep him contained and when he starts to bust out because he's on bad behavior then talk about counseling what an asshole right anyway all right dog. i think i'm taking up too much time but thanks for answering and thanks for everything that you do seizure you're very welcome cobra's blessings all right take think care. something nice for him okay he's gonna go into the red soon <coughs> No, I got a, I got monster imports to drink, so yeah, I'm signing chug, out. Chug him, boy. Bye. What? I'm sorry, Cobra's healing hotline. Wow, I uh, I got through. Yeah, you sorry, got through. I hit uh, redial like 500 times. <laughs> It's a, uh, it's a dark night. It's a very dark night. Cobra is in a coma. Yes, Cobra is in a coma. I was wondering, I know, on your uh, calling, you like to keep things moving. Got to keep it moving, which, uh, speaking of, Chauncey, I see you. I'm going to give you a call after this. But Keep it moving. Keep it moving. Got to keep it moving. <laughs> My question is, and obviously, if you don't, that's not going to be any hard feelings, mm. Mr. Seizure Robot. But if you think you have time, I have a little story that I could read to a sleeping boglum. It's, it's based on a true story. It's two pages long. It's entirely up to you, sir, if you would like me to read this Boglam lullaby. Uh, could you do it in a voicemail? I certainly can. I guess my question, yes. couple questions, do it in a voicemail? Do you want me to do it on a recording and mail it to you? And the other thing, do you want me to do it in my regular voice? Or would you like me to do it in my silly voice? I knew it. I knew it. This is that. You knew it? This is Doubtfire Cretan again. I don't like you. I don't like you. Not welcome. Not welcome. You're bringing bad energy. Bad energy. Making them sick. Making me sick. I oh. no. I'm sending you to the shadow oh. realm. Uh, 
uh, you can email oh. me that recording to leave it as a voicemail. Probably do the email that was. Okay, Get I out will. Of here, Mrs. I, will do I don't that. like you. All right, Get that's dirt. fine. No, 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 no. Uh uh-uh. uh. I don't think so. This is an emergency, and you're bringing that crap to this show. Uh-uh. I don't think so. Get banned from my channel. We need good energy. This is an emergency. Cobra's in a coma. I'm calling Chauncey. Sick of it. Cobra in a coma, I know, I know, it's really serious. The, the energy is, is resetting Cobra already. in a coma, hey, Caesar, this is Stephen Morrissey. Oh, Morrissey, lovely, lovely. No. <laughs> Feel better already. Yo. Hey. Yo, what's good? What is good? Ah. Uh. I'm I'm feeling. Uh, it was Cobra. Yo, Cobra's yeah. going into shock. Cobra was losing it. That guy wasn't bringing anything positive. Pure negativity sent him into shock. But now that you're back, he oh, has okay. he's normalized. He got Cobra back. Yeah, he's leveled up. He's, he's got uh, enough fucking Doritos in oh, his yeah. system and eggs. So many eggs. Listen, we've got him plugged up to so the greatest eggs. technology, feeding him Doritos, <laughs> yeah. eggs, and Dorito eggs. covered eggs, <laughs> and Bud Light Platinum. <laughs> <laughs> got a steady feed going in there. Yeah. <laughs> What's good, man? Oh, you know, had a little. Had a little problem yesterday, but we're past that, bringing in all the good energy, accumulating it, working hard on my projects. Got to get this podcast out. Got to get it out. Yeah, we yeah. need to, let's, uh, let's get some thoughts and prayers in the chat. Oh, What's up, please. chat? What What's up, egg up gang? Chat. <laughs> what did you say? What gang? Egg gang? Egg gang. <laughs> All right. Yo, we're the egg gang now. Egg What's gang. good? Up in here. Egg gang. All right. All right. My my kind of yolks. Y'all gonna make me eat these eggs up in here. <laughs> up in here. Y'all gonna make me spread these eggs up in here. Up in here. <laughs> oh. <laughs> what else is up, Chauncey? I haven't uh haven't visited your channel in a minute. Anything really cool going uh, on? Nothing. Nah, you know, cool and same old. Um, yo, I'm glad you're doing these weekly. This is like, this is tight. I look forward to these. Do you like Friday or Saturday better? Um, I mean, honestly, I'm like, I'm such a fan. I'll go, like, I'm here any day you go. You feel All me? All right. All right. Yeah. yeah I, Dedicated it ain't, fan. It ain't, yeah, it's, oh, you know, blessings. you're out here. If you're out here doing it, I'm going to watch it. I don't care if it's Friday, Saturday, fucking Tuesday, Monday. Yeah. <laughs> oh, and everyone's cranky Monday. Yeah, you know, yeah. Uh, fucking, wait, what, what, what's the bangle song? Uh, uh, Manic Monday. Just Another Manic Monday. I don't care if you do it on Just Another Manic Monday. I don't care if you do it on Friday. I'm in love. The oh, Cure. Wow. Oh, I wish I could have gotten <laughs> that in the Morrissey voice. Oh, can you stay with a fat girl who said, Oh, would you like to marry me? <laughs> like I'd love the ring. I don't care. I can't believe that's coming out of you. Dog, yo, I wish you would have, well, obviously, like, you don't know that my, I got a dope Morrissey impression. Yeah. (laughs) You've been holding out on us. You've had that in the, in the chamber. Yeah, well, you don't know that about me. No, no. I wish you would have fucking hollered at me for, Cobra in a coma, I know, 
It's really serious. <laughs> Yo, you know, I'm I'm a big I mean not so much Mars solo, but I yeah. love the Smith. I Smith's love the Smith. Yeah. Yo, yeah. big goth fan, Joy Davidson, Joey Davidson, all, all the iterations. Jamming out. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what what is Cobra's best quality just to top him off with some good energy? What is Cobra's best quality? He's I would say he is um he's very confident. He exudes oh, yeah. he oozes I mean as well as oozing grief, he oozes confidence as well. He's yeah. uh I would say he's um yeah he's like he's really like i mean he just he's the shit you know in his yeah. mind he is like the top dog there's like i mean i wish i wish i had even half the confidence that he had he's oh, just he's like reacting. he's reacting Right? He's yeah, coming, to he's life, coming back to life. He's coming back, he's coming to, back life. to life. I can hear uh, it. His, another great quality, uh, obviously, sexy goth bad boy, undeniable. Yeah. Uh, he, he sounds just like corn. Exactly like corn. Said, damn, I sound just like corn. <laughs> yeah. Damn, dude. Yeah. Wait, somebody's wait, somebody's requesting my cool pays. Ooh, the, yeah, that's right. Hold on. We need some uh, impersonations. I, I can give you a hey, moment. If what's the name, Bunny? Oh. Hey, what's the name, Bunny? I'm your host, cool peas. <laughs> <laughs> and then wait, wait, the same person was requesting my um Ah, this is Chris and Wes and Chandler from oh. Rutherville, Virginia. And I'm just here. People higher. on the internet, they're go giving me the people on the internet are giving me hate. There you go. Me a lot of hate. <laughs> they're mad at me. They're blaming at me. They people on the internet is showing me hate, giving me a lot of hate. <laughs> oh wait, no, hold on. <laughs> hey, look at me. I'm sitting here. Sad and lonely. <laughs> wow. Oh, fire. We've won. <laughs> Team fire tonight. Here <laughs> you say, I am a bold boy. <laughs> just sounds like Louis Anderson. That's all I'm hearing. Yo, oh. rip. Rip. Seriously, man. Seriously. Oh. I'm sure he's uh, looking I'm down on Cobra right now, hoping that uh, he can live as long as he did. He, uh, Louis, for being a big guy, he made it to his, what, mid-60s, I think? Yeah, rip. Pretty grim, but... Uh, you know what's crazy is the only thing I remember Louis Anderson from was fucking... Hi, I'm Louis Anderson from the New Feud. He, like, he was oh, he's yeah. the original Steve Harvey. Yeah. Man, I barely remember that era. I remember his show. It was called Life with Louie, and it was just unwatchable. I guess it was about his family growing up. But that was the biggest impact on me from, from all Louie. Yeah, man, rip. Rip, yeah. though. Baskets. I remember, yeah, Baskets was good, too, but. Yeah, rip F in the chat for I've Louis been, Anderson. I've been getting caught up on him. The I was watching some stand up when he uh it's the what Johnny Carson show or something. And this line got me so bad. He said, I'm sorry for sweating so much. If I don't do it, I'll explode. And my <laughs> delivery sucks balls, but it was so funny. I, I still don't understand what he meant, but it was golden. Yeah. Yeah. Sweat Michaels. <laughs> Did you say Sweat Michaels? Oh. Yeah. Like like <laughs> Brett Michaels, but with sweat? Yes. Sweat <laughs> Michaels. What? Yo, Vince Vince Meal. 
Let's go. <laughs> Damn, these are some those are some deep cuts, Chauncey. You got to give me some oh. warning before you bust those out. That that's a thinking man's no. joke. Oh, you know I'm playing. You know yeah. when we. You know how we get. We talk. I, yeah. I'm I'm down to clown. Down to clown. But Always. yo, yeah. Thank you for calling. I was frantically trying to call in. Oh yeah. But yeah, I needed someone to, me to rescue our boy. He was getting sick. Yeah. Anytime you anytime you're anytime you're going down, you need somebody to spice it up. Yeah. Just let me know and I will enter the fucking calls with Gonna answer pain, the extra call. crispy pieces <laughs> and a large gravy. Yes. Save the grease. <laughs> Yo, who in the chat? Real talk though. Who's saving the grease? Just kidding. That's not real talk. Save the egg scum. <laughs> That's the new thing. Yo. Got to save the egg. <laughs> and I save the egg scum. That's right. <laughs> but, That's yo, awesome thank man. you for calling. Yeah. Always love, love jumping in. Uh, depending on how long you go, maybe I'll fucking, maybe I'll pump the redial and try to call you again, but. That's right. I'll, I'll pump up the balling just for you. <laughs> yeah. Yo, my boy. Thank boy. you for calling me. Yeah. Always great talking to you. Shouts out to the Poot Gang, aka the Egg Gang. Egg Gang. Represent. AKA Chat Gang. Yeah. But uh, yo, have a good night. I'll be in the chat. I'll talk to you real soon, Chauncey. Be I'm here in cooling. spirit. I, I can feel you. Yeah. yeah. I'm in here. I'm in here, Caesar. He's a in a coma. I know. Oh, no, no. I know. It's really serious. <laughs> oh, get out of here. All right. Um, I'm going to be straight with you. I want more coffee. So I'm going to step away briefly, give you something to listen to in the meantime. Imagine a world where time would drift slowly. A world where music carries you away. Experience goth moods. A soundtrack for those who go against Love the Love was just a glance away. A warm embracing dance Remember away. the heartbreak with Punamans. Feel like a rock star. With the Smash Mouth. Unlock the Gothic Bad Boy with Britney Spears. Rock out with the Smooth Santa. No other collection gives you the feeling of Goth Moods. Imagine a world where time would drift slowly. A world where music carries you away. Experience goth moods. A soundtrack for those who go against Love the Love was just a glance away. A warm embracing dance Remember away. Remember the heartbreak with Punamon. Feel like a rock star with the Smash Mouth. Hit the ground running. Do it make sense, but not for the front. Just get on the Unlock the Gothic Bad Boy with Britney Spears. We'll rock out with the Smooth Santa. No other collection gives you the feeling of Goth Moon. Imagine a world where time would drift slowly. A world where music carries you away. Experience goth moods. A soundtrack for those who go against Love the Love was just a glance away. A warm embracing dance Remember away. Remember the heartbreak with Punamon. Too dumb, too dumb to realize that I Feel like a rock star. With the Smash Mouth. Do it make sense, but not for the front.
Unlock the Gothic Bad Boy with Britney Spears. Rock out with a smooth Santa. No other collection gives you the feeling of goth movies. Imagine a world where time would drift slowly. A world where music carries you away. Experience goth moves. A soundtrack for those who go against Love the grain. Love was just a glance away, a warm embracing dance Remember away. Remember the heartbreak with Punamon. You don't, you don't realize that I feel like a rock star with, with the Smash Mouth. Unlock the Gothic Bad Boy. All right. We're back. We got coffee. I did a little combo breaker there. Got some coffee. <laughs> did a little bio. I, I was thinking, I am aware of how unnatural I sound when I try to use street lingo. I sound like the whitest man on the planet when I uh, try to use those words. I'm still learning. Back in the day, I had co-workers that would teach me words like ratchet. They'd teach me words like ratchet and what they mean, and I'd say them, and they'd laugh and laugh. Wonderful, wonderful. Let's get some calls in. Cobra's in a coma. Hey. Yeah. What's going on, man? Oh, trying to keep things positive, keep it moving. Cobra's not feeling well. Have you gotten a good look uh, at him? Yeah. Um, I don't know about that. I'm actually on County 10, the Twitter feed. I'm reading a tweet that came out 19 minutes ago. Unidentified Casper man apprehended in graveyard while raping corpse of transgender child. Oh, no. And I'm looking at Cobra's not streaming right now, so... Cobra's in a coma. He's got, for once, he's got a solid alibi. He is dead asleep. Okay, all right. I, I think it was... Uh, there may be some other suspects. Uh, you mentioned a child... Kind of it sounds like a certain furry I know. Bald-headed bastard. Creeps me out. Do I got to say it? I don't know. It, I'm not trying to jump to conclusions. Right, right. Let's not point fingers. Is that, is that guy even still living? I, I don't know where that guy's at anyway. So. I hear he comes back in set intervals to uh, torment the town of Casper. Mm. Usually there's a big disaster or, or some kind of incident. He's hanging out down there in the sewers. He gets his victims wrapped up in their cocoons, and he eats them. And he, he loves eating children, but they got to be scared first. Got to get them good and salty. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Well, uh, I appreciate uh, the heads okay. up. For, for everyone in Casper, watch out. I'm going to let you out. I'm Play me off. I'm going to give you my best Danny Phil shriek. Oh, let's hear it. Oh! <laughs> what was, oh, um, bye. Damn it. What was that one line? Um, There's something in the fog. Or alternatively, could you give me a ding dangling my dong with a shriek? Ding dangling. <laughs> ding dangling my dong. Attaboy. He liked that. Bless you. Later. Oh, Ghost in the Fog. Thank you. Thank you. Ghost in the Fog! D.
ding dangling my dog. Hello. Yeah. Um, I don't know what the fuck that was, but like you're a little pussy ass bitch. You can keep doing that shit, all right? Like, fuck mm-hmm. off, honestly. Oh, you got some foul words, friend. What's going on? You're you're hurting Cobra. That doesn't. That's not so nice. You're fucking hurting after this fucking shit, bro. <laughs> Who is this? What do you call yourself? Uh, my name is uh, Crenshaw Mafia. Oh, okay. I thought it was Percy Femur for a second. He's a real bully. He talks like you do. Uh, yeah, I'll take that. Hurts my feelings every time. I jam my balls in the toaster. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Why'd you do that? Um, so I got a used condom for you guys, but it doesn't fit properly. And it's like used and shit. So like, can I return it? Uh, this isn't the Grondike Soap Company, friend. I think you got the wrong number. Oh, but I had used condom, bro. No, oh, no, no. They they do have a unique brand of condoms. They've got pheromones in it. Uh, I'm I'm a big fan. Is it because they're used already? Uh, I don't know about like uh, Pedro soil used them. Used. You know? Yeah, yeah. No, no <laughs> like friend. Pedro's a little bitch. Not gonna lie. Uh, uh-huh. I pull up on him. Oh yeah. Well, uh, keep them balls out of the toaster, will you? You're going to get grill marks on them. Hey, yeah, I'm sure with that. Like, that's kind of tasty, not going to lie. Yeah. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Man. Uh, all right. Well, uh, I'm a I, fucked up little bit. Okay? You're, you're, uh, you're out there, friend. I, I'm, I don't know what to say, Percy. Yeah, I better smoke some mass. Peace out. All right. Catch you later. <laughs> That was, I could not follow that guy. What was he talking about? I did the best I could, but all I did was get concerned. I thought he was about to say uh, some, some words. And uh, I had, the, had my thing on the button, which uh, with the delay won't make it in. But calling me names. Yes. Are you, are you hey. going to make fun of me, too? No. No, I just had to switch off the stream so it wasn't echoing. Oh, I appreciate that. That's good. That's good. Well, you have better manners already than that other guy. I mm. wanted to... Um, mm. I'm sure not as fun as the other guy since he was giving shit. Uh. I wanted to talk a little bit, uh, hypothesize a bit about Clint and his ability and ability we all have, really, to heavily compartmentalize ourselves. And have you had you emailed to me before in the past? Uh, yes, yes, I have. Was it like a series of? Oh my goodness! It was almost ten unique recordings, right? Yes, yes, initially for your radio show. I, I remember. Yeah, yeah. There were a lot of words. Um, woof. Um, entirely, entirely too many words. I hope, I hope you understand. Could you give me the Cliff Notes version? I don't want to be a bad guy. You caught me no, in a no, bad you're... mood. A bad mood. And I'm taking it no, out I... on you, friend. <laughs> No, that is that is just fine. I think what a lot of it comes down to is just it is two parts. One, the less that he directly acknowledges uh, Cobra, the more he can ignore the problem. Kind of, if he doesn't see it, then yes. he doesn't have to give it its full weight. And then with that comes the fact that because he has put himself in a position where he's treating it as if he's l- letting Cobra lead his own life, even though it's his avoidance. The second part about that is he can't directly um, confirm or deny this, so he just denies it. And he says that all these rumors he hears are obviously just trolls, because there's no way he doesn't hear about the trolling. Um, and if he can just say, well, obviously Cobra, well, he, I'm sure he doesn't call him Cobra. Obviously, George has a few problems, but I know he has a bunch of trolls 
So anything that would require my attention is trolls. Yeah. Uh, and I will never see or know otherwise. Yeah. Uh, yeah. And that's that's pretty much it. And also, I think now stop me if this is a little controversial, but I also think Clint has an undeniable attraction for Cobra. And he really wants to spread those filthy chapped ass yeah. cheeks yeah. and just clap them. And just clap them. And, you know, maybe it's happened before. I don't like this. We're losing him. We're maybe. losing him. Talking about clapping Cobra's dirty cheeks. Well, if we're losing him, we're then losing perhaps him. our words... Our words are reaching him, and it's bringing up bad memories. Oh, memories. Get out. I banished you. Dad I banished you. Get him. out. <laughs> it's an emergency. It's an emergency. We need help. Somebody get help. This is bad. This is bad. Someone save our boy. I don't like this. Gotta get it. Gotta get it. Oh, come on. Save Cobra. You gotta save him. Give him some positive energy right now. Hey, funny. <laughs> Rock, I was no. watching your stream. No. <laughs> Who's the fifth red light flat lining of the chair? <laughs> no, Roger. Now's not the time. <laughs> no, we're gonna lose hey, him. I, is that Cobra? <laughs> I've seen him down at the Honka Burger. He's always attempting food challenges, but he can't even get down one double Honka Burger and a large fry boy barfs all over the place like a capital L loser. <laughs> get out, Roger. God damn it. Fuck, I hate Roger Klotz. I hope Percy creams Klotz. Hey, hey am, I, am I actually on? Yes, we need energy now. Holy shit. He's hurt. Um, so, I'm gonna be quick, because I'm calling long distance from my work and my boss will kill me. But, uh, I just wanted to, I just wanted to tell you one of my favorite videos that not a lot of people know about, um, that's kind of related He's to dying. the Cobraverse. He's so, dying. You the need way, to help him now. Say something nice, okay? Please? The way I found Cobra is the way a lot of people found Cobra, which is the Trapped documentary. Oh. And the oh. trap duck oh. went trapped. After he was done with that, you're killing me, man. Come on, just let me tell my story. You're going to watch this video. It's going to be very funny. Oh. Oh, uh, we don't have much time. Okay. you gotta, you got to say something pleasant. Listen. Listen. Trapped went to Hampow's place. Yes. Awesome. I didn't even hang up on him. He is. These are death farts. These aren't alive farts. He is, he's gonna fart until he's dead. This isn't good. We need help. Hey, we need a blessing stat. Help. Hi. Um. Yes. Hello. Yes. Yes. Um, well, I wouldn't normally do this, but it seems like a really dire situation. Yes, it is. I'm willing to end Cobra's dry spell. I'll come down to Casper and take his anal, vir anal virginity. Oh, he's back. Well, let's just hope he, he missed that last part, okay? <laughs> I didn't like that last <laughs> bit, but I think that's enough. And you know, at this point, he might be willing to compromise. Uh, is it a twofer or is it only butt stuff? Only. Yeah, that's the only thing I'm up. Yeah. Ain't, mm. Take it or leave it. What? Mm. You know, it's really weird. You sound like, do you know uh, Emily from from a, a different... Emily? Yeah, yeah. Is this Emily? Um, no. Oh, dang it. All right. What do you call yourself? Um, well, I just go by Poe. Mm. Poe, is that like an acronym or anything? 
Uh, no, it's just a nickname. Sorry, I couldn't really think of anything funny. I didn't think I was going to get through. Well, you brought him back to life, so thank you. Oh, thank However, goodness. he's right on the edge, because I think he's starting to understand that you want to put stuff in his bottom. All right? I don't, I'm not a fan. Listen, could you, could you compromise? Um... Is there any way that you could sweeten the pot a little bit? Uh, let me see. Um, well, if goo cheese is going to be there, I guess we could work something out. Uh-oh. I've heard about this goo cheese person. Are you in league with them? Ow. Um, No, but I would, I'm interested in that to see... What's going to happen? See what the hell happens. Yeah, yeah. No, I can uh, I can get behind that. Behind. Maybe we can also get to the bottom of it. Yeah. Maybe. Uh-huh. All right. Well, thanks for resurrecting Cobra. Listen, if you can, stay out of his ass. Um, there's I'll some great try. pictures of his butthole out there if you want to see. Oh, my God. I've seen them. Yeah. <laughs> It's, it's, yeah. uh, that's a killer butthole. He, uh, he spread those cheeks wide open. Yeah, I was goat feet on the farm before. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Terrible. Yeah, at least that's not that, uh, Nico Avocado guy. I actually, I unfortunately was exposed to I haven't seen those, but I've heard a lot about them. Apparently everyone has. It's it's the tallest yeah. butthole you've ever seen. <laughs> it it is okay. really tall. That's all I can say. It's like the eye of Sauron. You you don't want to look directly into it. Oh like a cat's eye kind of thing. Yeah, yeah. Uh. All right. Uh you know what? Okay. We're we're starting to lose them. I am I'm starting to not feel well. Uh, shame on you. But also thanks for resurrecting Cobra. He, he's out of the red. Okay. All right. Well, hugs and kisses. Bye. Mm. Ugh, Cobra. Cut that out. Hey. Making room, huh? boy. Thinking about Nikado Avocado's butt again. How many times are we gonna do this song and dance? I'm sick of it. I'm trying to find the picture that makes me think of uh, that monster. Cobra's in a coma. Cobra's in a coma. Oh no, oh no. It's really serious, isn't it serious? It is. Hello. Hey, Morrissey. Oh, yes, Morrissey, you sound hello. the best. Oh, you, are, you are partying hard tonight, aren't you, Morrissey? Damn. I, I just got a call. Oh, okay, I okay. I just got a call. <laughs> Morrissey, I love your music. Uh, Thank you. Thanks for, Thank you. for your lovely song Thank about you. Cobra. I. Uh, I was so, I just got a call. I was on I was on call. Uh -huh. I don't know what's going on. And then I was saying that he was dying. Yeah. He's not well I mean, and you, you sprang into action. I gotta be real with you. Yeah. Oh shit. I got I gotta be real with you. Oh my god. Yes. Uh, Cobra was medically induced into that coma. It's, it's not it's not a fault of his own drinking or the it's not genetics it's not eggs yeah it's not constant bullying from the oh internet. no it's not it's not the haters okay it was the government the go oh is it, you think this is a conspiracy to put cobra in a coma yeah they put him in a coma What's, Absolutely. What's the the strategy here? What's the long term game? Oh, oh. The long term game. Yeah. Is obviously the reduction of content. It's to upset an entire community of people and debase uh, the group itself. All right. 
you, I'm uh, starting uh, to I'm starting to lose you a little bit on that one. You've confused me. But this bring array, me back chaos. in. Bring uh, me back in. Uh, oh, oh, okay. Um, well, Cobra's in a coma. Yes. Do you know? I know. I know. It's serious. It's very serious. It's very serious. Well, all right. It's trying to well, make sense. Well, I appreciate to me now. your time, and I just want to let you know, uh, Cobra's not going to wake up. So, uh, <laughs> oh, good luck. no, right. no, don't say yeah. that, please. Oh, no, is it? Is it bro? He owns me. He owns me in the trolls. I need more content. You know, Stay. He, he he rules my sad, pathetic life. Yeah, and uh, yeah, and I'm and I'm just an OSS agent. Anywho, you and uh, Mr. have a Green good one. Both. Yeah, absolutely. You're in league with the around the water cooler. Yeah. He's a good guy. He's really handsome. You better, Mr. Green is handsome. You better wake yeah. him back up, so, stat. Yeah, I will. Give him the, right. the good nerve. Wake nerve-ish. up, wake up, Cobra. I love you. All right. That's what I'm talking nope. about. Starting to reject calls. All right, <laughs> there we go. Sorry about that. Freaking Google Voice sucks. Cobra's blessings. Yes, Colin. Hello. Yeah. What's up? Oh, not much. Are you here for the uh, cool taste impersonation competition? No. Oh, I can't do a cool taste. I'm not that cool. That's all right. We're not all gifted, friend. Anyway, what matters what's up? is your best wishes to Cobra. He needs your faith and energy and and nice intentions. Say nice things. All right. I can all right. do that. Resurrect. Bring, it, bring the wind back to his dead balls, okay? All right. Okay. All right. Let's. I'm. I'm gonna open the channels up to you. Just let me hear All it. All right. Let's hear some nice things about Cobra. Mm. Okay. Yes. Don't worry. Take your time. Oh wait! Right now. Oh yeah. Okay. Yeah. First of all, I just wanted to compliment on his guitar playing and how. Mm, yes. It's actually really amazing, and there's actually no one else on earth that can play like that. Oh, he's smiling. Yeah. So I just wanted to really highlight on that, and also yes. his dental hygiene. I really look up to that. Mm. And I just oh, it's it's been concerning really him, too, it. yeah. I'm sure he's going to be relieved to hear that, yeah. Yeah, and his, his amazing head shape, but it's... I really love the way it resembles Mr. Peanut in like an egg. Hey. Similar shape. Hey, no. He looks like Vin Diesel, okay? All right. Yeah. You cool uh, it with that. All right. All right. Well, I mean, two out of three. I'm also a huge fan of Doritos, so I really wanted to talk about Doritos a little bit. Oh, well, yeah. What's your favorite flavor? Well, I'm more of a cool ranch guy, which I don't know if Cobra would really, you know, agree with, but, you know. I, got I think he likes, the, uh, he likes the nacho flavor quite a bit, doesn't yeah, he? Yeah, yeah. You see that red yeah. bag. He went as far as to smoke them, which he doesn't recommend. Might be part of you know, why I've... he's in the state he's in right now. He may have smoked a bowl of Doritos. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna play you to, out. I'm gonna, I, <laughs> I have to ask. Yeah. Why are y'all saying that our Lord is in a coma? He's in a coma. He ate too many today. eggs. And he had passed out on stream, or like what happened? He's in a coma, dude. 
Oh, Look at him. Jilly. Yeah. I see that. He ate two dozen eggs. He drank some oh, dog no. medicine because it was banana flavored, but it was 99 proof bananas. And then he had some ZZ. Yeah, food. I read that. Had a little juice box up. Dog? Why does he have dog medicine? It was left over from Clint's house. Really old. Expired dog medicine. All right, friend. Thank you for the blessings. All right. All right. Oof. He's so sleepy. How do these people get so sleepy? If you like me, and drink way too much coffee. Cobra Fan Club. Cobra's in a coma. Oh, hey, I actually got through. Oh, listen to that call quality. How did you achieve this? Uh, is it that good? Oh, it's much better than the others. Are you dialing through some kind of uh, like IP voice service? No, no, no. Uh, this is through uh, Google Voice. Oh, okay. I, uh, I uh, got you. I, hey, I've, I've heard a lot of speculation concerning uh, Cobra's whereabouts, and I just want to say that I'm a representative of Procter & Gamble at uh, Helen of Troy Limited. Uh, you may know my company or one of them uh, as Vix or uh, NyQuil. Yes, yes. Uh, we have reason to believe that during a recent uh, proposed sponsorship, he actually went a little overboard with it. And oh, you gave him some free stuff, didn't you? With him. Yeah, we wanted to promote our product. We figured he'd be a good hey, medium well, considering uh, how much beer and alcohol that he consumes. Um, yeah. You and got him uh, what better candidate? Give He's how many bags did you give to our boy of ZZ Quill? Bags? Yeah, bags. Uh, it's, it's you ever seen how the we Canadians... don't have our products in bags, uh -oh. sir. Uh oh. Uh, we we have it in bottles. Oh. Easy. Okay. To, we got a little for him too. We got these little uh, like toddler caps to put on top, so there's no spillage. He does struggle with uh, the childproof caps. I was going to say, when he was discovered, you know how the Canadians drink milk out of bags? Oh, yeah. They're weirdos. Yeah. He had bags of ZZ Quill that he'd apparently drank from. So I think <laughs> someone, I mean, maybe Warlord hooked him up or, you know, he made his own concoction. He may have made a dank drink <laughs> combo, but bags of ZZ Quill with like a straw poked in them. Uh, I mean, I... I don't know what to say. That does not represent the company that I um, am representing. Serious but. question here. Uh, is the alliance still on? Is he still going to be able to represent the company if he ever wakes up? Uh, that all depends. Um, we need to know how much he he took. Um, because, he took a lot. Yeah. He drank a lot. I mean, we don't want him... We don't want him lagging or like lagging on production of these uh commercials we want these commercials you know quick we got to throw them out on youtube he, he was you know. really uh giving you guys a solid recommendation for his head cold now i need to ask you for uh zz quill does it have any medicinal right. purpose i mean he was taking it for a sinus infection uh i mean does tactical soap have any purpose hey don't play lawyer ball with me mister uh i mean that's it's all speculation uh yeah. it may not say sp specifically on the bottle that hey, it takes care of head colds but well, I know if you're, you're you know you're slimy if you're, if you're 11 beers in and you're drinking slimy three to four greasy capfuls of <laughs> sequel uh, yeah it'll take care of that head cold you need to take responsibility you shouldn't have given him the Zequel. You gave him the stuff. Now look at him. Look at the state he's in. You did this. I mean, I can't look at the state of him. He's he hasn't come back online. He's right here. Right here. This this is this is it. Cobra's in a coma. He looks See the hospital he's in. Dead. He looks like G.G. Allen. He... <laughs> it's, not, it's not looking. Are so you hot. sure this is the man that we're uh, supposedly having? do these commercials this is the man this is the man yeah make no mistake he is a Jesus man fucking christ he is a man yeah i gotta i gotta get in touch with the some of the board members i don't know about this, this no 
No, don't Shit. don't cut him off, You're please. Gonna, hey, hey. Keep this conversation. Um, I'll send you some money in your pay now. Um, okay, okay. You you can buy me off, but it's Cobra you gotta worry about. He's already reacting to this. He he does not want to break off the partnership. Well, with any luck, he'll forget about it entirely. Depending we'll on how much is that. Brain's probably wow. scrambled at this point. Shame on you. you know, Get out. I Get out of here. Shame I, on I didn't you. mean for this. Beat it. Uh, Scram. We need some help. We need some help. Cover's reacting. This is good. All my insights. Cobra's in a coma, he's reacting strong. This is an emergency. Seizure, seizure. Oh my yes. god, I was playing Darkest Dungeon. I somehow called in and made it in a second time. Oh, How well done. I just heard the news. Yes. Can we get some good thoughts and prayers? Good thoughts and uh, thoughts. Oh, yeah. Ball. It's an emergency. Okay. Uh, he's redlining. Uh, Cobe. Hey, Cobe. Cobe, listen. Listen. Yeah. Think about your PayPal. The, the PayPal money. Think about... You haven't it's won the lottery in. yet, Cobe. You yeah, you he has so won. much to live for. I know he, you haven't won the lottery. Yes, uh, you, you're a clock tower. You, you need you need to get your clock tower code. You, you have too much to live for. Don't don't die on us, man. Go. We need yeah. we need the the green flame to light his black smoke. Do I have it right? How's the phrase go? I think I think it's backward, but uh, whatever. Oh, I mean, oh if, let's make it up. Green smoke is all we have. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, no. Cove's green smoke is fine. <laughs> Look, man, we're, we're under a lot of stress. Mistakes are okay. A lot of stress. A lot of stress. I, but, I don't but do well. Cove, I didn't know you for that long, but I love you. Oh. Hey, don't. <laughs> now, you, next thing you know, you're going to be saying rest in peace. I don't like this. This is serious. Oh, no, no, no. Don't. Don't rest in live in peace, Cobra. Live, live, in, <laughs> live in peace. Live in peace. Live in peace. All right, I'm gonna get yes. some reinforcements. Okay, we're gonna get some more positive energy. Darkest dungeon is great. Uh, tips and tricks. I like talk to you. Uh, that well, I mean, yeah, double occultist crit trinkets. It's mm. a lot of fun, and mm. sometimes I hate it. It seems to be working. I'm gonna. I know I'm gonna get screwed. Oh. <laughs> it's inevitable in Darkest yeah. Dungeon. You're gonna get it. Is he? Is he? Is Cope still doing bad? Oh, he's real bad. Yeah, he he's oh, about fuck. to leave yeah, this yeah. gay earth. Oh shit! R bring in, bring in some. I don't All know. All right, who. we're bring gonna in cool bring taste. in somebody. <laughs> Hopefully, not cool taste. Not cool taste. I hope not. Just save him. Just yeah. save him. Save him. Somebody. <laughs> All right, get yeah. out. We need some help. We need help with that. Need an assist. It's getting rough in here. You gotta save him. He's 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 dying. Hello? He's dying. Is he oh, okay? Wonderful. No. Is this an of age human female? You betcha. Oh, please help him. He's he's dying on us. I uh, well, I am married, but like I am of age, but like okay. you know, here. I, what can I do? What 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 what, what do you do? Oh, tell him he's handsome, will ya? He is handsome. Oh. He's very handsome. Oh. He's got... <laughs> yeah. yeah. Don't stop. Yeah. He's got this bad boy gospel. Yeah. Oh. Rock and roll. <laughs> oh, he's settling down. Okay, okay. Okay, good, good. What good, else you got? You okay? We need to seal the deal. Well, uh, we need to seal the deal? Yeah, yeah. yeah. That dry spell, it's, it's coming to an end. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> there it goes. Oh, he's saved. Yeah. Oh, he's, he's, he's feeling been, better already. That's just what he needed neutralized. to hear. <laughs> Thank God. Those who wait <laughs> patiently. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, what lovely energy. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, well, okay, I'm here to help. I'm just glad that our boys do it all right. I'm, yes, you know, he like... has come back to us. <laughs> I, he was fading on us for a second there. Yeah, the, the Metroid music it, it stresses me out. <laughs> it stresses me out, yeah. It's it's a tense situation. Oh, my gosh. I'm looking at the chat. Someone's saying that Walnut status is definitely... 
soaked. Than usual. Oh yeah, <laughs> it's waterlogged at this point. <laughs> it's drowning. It's, it's drowning. Not. Yeah. <laughs> Let these snails. I am in not here. goth. No, I'm not. You're oh, aw, <laughs> poser. Yeah. That eh, hasn't right. stopped him. He likes all kinds of women. It doesn't matter if you're goth. Yeah, what, he does. He do you does. have a Do you have a dark hair, raven black hair? Yeah. It's, oh. It's, <laughs> okay. It is dark. Yes. Yeah. What about your eyeballs? My eyeballs? No, mm-hmm. they're not. They're not any special color. They're just mm. black. Okay. You know? okay. Someone compares to a shark's eye. You know. A shark's eye. Like yeah, a hammerhead? Uh, it's probably like a... I don't know. Yeah, maybe. Maybe. I don't know. I, I didn't expect <laughs> that compliment. <laughs> yeah. All right. Well, uh... Yeah, just black. Yeah, yeah. well, I'm glad I got to help, and uh, I'm glad I got in. I got tired of being called a butt munch a lot. But, oh, you know, they've been getting take it. Take what you get. The, the <laughs> butt munch count is off the charts. So many angry oh. people. <laughs> so many people. Oh, bless you, you uh, alive of AIDS, age funny, cisgender, um, <laughs> Gender, yeah, human. Did I say human? Yeah, yeah, and you know, of age is important. Female. I, we're here to serve female, yes. Not trans. Don't you dare be trans. <laughs> <laughs> oh I'm gonna leave you with that. Get out of here. <laughs> that just broke her brain. Sounded like crying at the end. Jeez. At least our boy's back. Yes. How do, friend? Hey, hey, bro. What's up? So everybody keeps saying that Cobra's in a coma. Cobra's in a coma. Yeah, that's not the story, though. So, mm-hmm. What's the scoop? Yeah. What I heard is he woke up and uh, went to get some of his beans out of a can. He fought with that fucking can opener Oh, just all wrestled day. with it. All fucking day. He's just yeah. real tired. He that's wore himself all. out. He's just taking a nap. Yeah, he's real <laughs> tired. He's but, taking a nap. Oh, okay. He okay. works hard, dude. He works He's really hard, hard. Make no mistake. He works hard for his money. He has a full-time oh, yeah. job. <laughs> the business exchange. Yeah. He's an entrepreneur. Yeah. He's a tycoon. He's the only wand maker in Casper. So what is, what is the happiest that you've ever seen Cobra? Oh, Wow. There was a video where he was hanging out with Stephanie and he had a full on boner. It was, it was bobbing up and down in his camo pants. And I mean, that's got to be a peak. He is on YouTube. He's got a girlfriend and he has an erection. You can't oh, beat that. That. Hog, that hog does not quit, boy. No, no. He summoned that serpent. It was raging. Yeah, I, I mean, I haven't seen that one. I'll have to catch it. I think the happiest I've ever seen is when he got the Jesus is a C-word shirt in the mail. Oh, was he pretty he stoked when he got that? ecstatic. Yeah? <laughs> ecstatic. I don't think I've ever seen him that fucking happy. Hmm. He loves that thing. Let me get my Discord up. It has been shut down nonstop. I want, I know there's a gif of him with the, the boner. Uh, bobbing away. Um, oh, I would love to see that hog motion. Who the... F- you? Mm, I'm definitely going to not be in Discord if people are trying to call me direct. That is unacceptable. <laughs> Unbelievable. Anyway. But hey, Cobra, Cobra said he... Um, you know, when he gets his, his rest in, he'll be back and around. I, I he like the sound He never that. got that... Uh, he never got that can of beans open, though. Oh, he lost the battle. Maybe tomorrow. Battle of the beans. Maybe next time. Maybe tomorrow. Never that figured out can that can opener. Man. Yeah. His worst enemy. <laughs> They're going to be back to the end of time. And hats. Yeah, can openers and hats. Those are his two. Hats. 
<laughs> yeah, man. Sworn enemy. Yeah. I mean, can't fucking get a hat. All right. The right dog. size to save his life. No, sir. They just don't fit. You just got to break them in a little until they give out. Oh, that fucking, that fucking board is big, man. It's, that's that a big gourd, and it's only getting bigger. <laughs> it is, uh, is growing by the day. Yeah, man. It is, literally. Yeah. By the day. All right, big dog. I'm going to see hey, thank you, you man. later, anytime. It. Calling me. Calling me. Mmm. Not for real. If, uh, if anyone has that gift, I know it's out there. It's it's hard to find. Him and Stephanie, he's got the boner. It's bobbing away. Really funny. Oh, shit. I've done it again. Hang on. Hey. Hello. Hey, I'm sorry. I actually hung up on that one. Oh, you're fine. You're fine. Got too many buttons. I am a representative of NyQuil. That man is not in the coma. That man is on his own. We do not represent Key Cobra J events whatsoever at the NyQuil company. Are you one of the board members? I, I am a very, very well representative of the NyQuil company. That man is not in his coma because of our product. That man is in a coma by choice. By oh, so he put himself in a coma. He, uh, even though there is an empty bottle right there, it's not our fault. Mm, I don't know. Uh, it, sounds no pretty greasy to me. me. You sound greasy. I don't trust it, you. Excuse me, sir. Sounds greasy. like someone's getting nervous. The great no. What's greasy is Josh's forehead from cooking all that fucking food. <laughs> oh. Oh, he can't cook with the shit. Mm -mm. Watching him cook is horrible. Hey, like, you're killing him. It, it, Haven't you done enough? It's the grease that's shedding his arteries. It is not our product. I promise you the air. Oh, they got you on retainer, huh? It, it, my asshole, they do. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Fancy New York lawyer coming in, yeah, telling me do. what's what. I, I am, I am a very representative Jew, okay? I am in the synagogue. I am the Mechayim. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> How much money does he stand to win if if he uh, puts a pin in you guys for what you've done to him? Nothing. He, he is doing, this is false accusations. He is a, he is, he is false, falsely accusing us, smearing the smear campaign. This is a smear campaign. That's what it Schmier. is. Smear. Schmear. <laughs> Just like the schmear that I put on my bagel every morning. Yeah. Well, everything bagel. Oh, I, I can see through your lies and your, your tricks. Your um, New York tricks. Uh, that's surprising. I can't see past my nose. Oh, oh, oh. We're getting to some dangerous territory. You're going to get me shut down, friend. Oh, oh should I stop? <laughs> <laughs> oh <laughs> no, nah, you're okay. You're okay. We just uh okay. we have to just speak in code. Oh, that's all. Just have to speak in code. <laughs> well, I'll tell you what, he's gonna get more than a red cent from you guys, you and your dirty tricks. I can see you already rubbing your hands together from the darkness, <clears throat> scheming, trying to pull one over, pulling the wool over his eyes. Shame on you. I just got word from the head CEOs. We want Cobes to be a representative of the corporation, a uh, mascot, because he got the big cartoon lips. He's got the big what? Big bulging eyes. <laughs> he's got big cartoon lips, the bulging eyes. We're gonna. He, he'll be for, he'll be the new ad campaign for ah, the THC. Yes. yes. That's, THC quill. That's, that's more like it. Me. That's more like it. That's yeah. what I want. Cobes, if you are going to. Cobes, you need to call us. We're going to make you a giant deal. And we're going to use your face on everything. It's an exploding we're going to put it offer. on our bottles. 
<laughs> our bottles. Uh, we're gonna, gonna put you on our bottles. It's gonna be the deal of a lifetime. It's gonna look like a missing stupid. children's campaign on the milk cotton. Uh, <laughs> the <Z-Quil. laughs> Can you say that? Can you say that last bit one more time? The ZZ Quill. Yo, we'll put his face on it like a missing kids campaign. (laughs) Have you seen this boy? Yeah, but have you been this sleepy before? Oh man, tell you what, when, when I when I want to be put to bed, I'm going to look at that mug of his and, and just feel my eyes drooping, the drool coming out. He's going to put me uh, right to sleep. Oh. Exactly. That's what we want to represent on our bottles. Our, our bottles. <laughs> He's going to be sleeping on his, we'll make sure the chair's in there. We'll have to definitely... Definitely touch it up with some paint jobs because that shit's rough. Oh, that just a little airbrush. Rough. No big deal. Yes. And, we'll, and we got to keep his, his fishy lips and his big eyes. <laughs> <laughs> he, has the, he has the lips of a cop and the eyes of a gypsy. Wow. Uh oh. Oh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. You're crossing no, the line. Man. Crossing the line, friend. Going too far. I'm gonna get rid of you. I'm I'm gonna uh, oh, rid you yeah, from you're totally my fine. Go uh, ahead. stream. Thank <laughs> you so much. <laughs> Anytime. Jesus. Hey, thanks for taking my call. Hey there, partner. Hello. Yes. Hey. Thanks, partner. Oh, I'm really uh, hey there, cowboy. About this, what, what's this that? Boggling. Boggling? Losing his life uh, and learning this way. He's uh, hanging on by a thread. I Hopefully it's a noose. Uh, you know, I'm really, I'm really oh, broken no. down. I'm praying for the community. Uh, yeah. Hey, uh, you're talking. I, I, I can smell him from here. Yeah. Um, it's almost like the corpse is only 26 days old. You keep that up, uh, we're going to tangle, friend. Uh, oh, no. I don't... This seems to have gone bad for me. Um, I'm just attending the funeral of my good oh. friend. Yeah, who's your friend? Uh, he's a well-regarded in the community. He's a sort of little... He's got a jacket of plaque on his teeth to keep his teeth safe from the oil that drinks. It's uh, critical to um, the structural integrity of those teeth. Shame on you, our boy is, he's, he's passing. you telling him that he's hanging on by a noose. How dare you? Oh, I thought, I thought it was very gaudy. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. He settled back down. Oh, thank God. That was a close uh, Wait a second, he's alive? That well, can't possibly be. I've seen all of his cooking videos. Uh, yeah, yeah. I think it finally caught up with them. I think he needs to make a few changes to his lifestyle. Yeah, double, double lettuce, double like zucchini, double cucumber, right? You know, I, uh, I heard they were they were uh, changing the recipe on uh, Jimmy Dean sausage. They were they the quantity is not as much these days. Have you heard about this? <laughs> Holy shit! Yeah, yeah, it, it got me fired I up. I, I mean, are, are you as fired up as I am? I'll tell you what, it can't be. I'm about two hundred thirty pounds. My wife's not small neither. <laughs> Is she? Uh, what nationality? <laughs> Fuck, I don't remember. A little Scotch, Scotch girl. Three hundred pounds of Scotch girl. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> you fucking got me, boy. You got uh-huh. me with that. Keep up the good fight for right. well, uh, getting, I guess getting if he's the old alive, size then back. I got no reason to be here. Oh, but you call you the Undertaker. That's what you are. You uh, came here to so collect. Under carriage, maybe. Under carriage. Ooh, you want the body. You want the cold body. You're gonna slab them. 
I, I'll, I'm hoping to put it on the end of a, a wand that I'm making with my. Oh, brother. keep him in carbonite and a really big wand. I think you'd be better off putting him on the end of a big rig or something. Can you imagine? Uh, you might, you might have me there. You might put our boy right on the front of a big rig, doing some kind of pose. I just imagine him screaming. But I'm not I'll as leave creative that to you. as this man. Well, you know. You embalm him just right. You can have him do any pose you want. But he's not going to leave us, okay? Stop talking like that. Okay. All right. Thank God. Okay, well, I guess I'm going to get back to hitting my wife and all that. No, oh, be gentle. Take care now. Love keep you, Chauncey. Keep up the good fight. Love you, Seizure. Oh, love you too, cowboy. Time to hit that dusty trail. Hello. Hey, buddy. Ah, what's up? Again. Who's this? So, I think that we're going to have to file a class action lawsuit for our boggling here. Oh, you guys are busy. You know, you're coming and going. Your your New York friend came in saying that he's going to make him an yeah, affiliate man. and a sponsor or something. And now you're saying that you're going to hit him with lawsuits. What's it going to oh, be? Oh, yeah. You're flip flop. So, You're waffling. Here's the problem. Yeah. Z Quill doesn't have a warning label on it that says you can't masturbate and take it. Okay. That's incredibly, uh, well, we're going to sue them for that so that this uh, doesn't happen again because our chronic masturbator boy here. Yes. It's caught up to him. Now that you mention it, when we found him, uh, there was some compromising material found on his computer. It looks as yeah. if he was having quite the session. I suspect his pants were around his ankles, too. Oh, uh, they were. And, uh, you know, he's always free balling it. So basically, they're almost yeah. like tearaway pants. Uh, once they're off, you he's know, ready to go. Someone must have really pissed him off. You know, he had one of those anger bait sessions. Oh, yeah, where he talks about his subscriber count. Talks about a subscriber count, goes on uh, goes on Chatterbait. And, yeah. You know, he had two windows the R up. Word. He had one with his subscribers and the other, the Chatterbait window. It, I didn't even think about this, that it would have something to do Ooh, with yeah. his, his current condition. Yeah, he shouldn't be uh, medicating and masturbating, you know? <laughs> That's a bad <laughs> two combination. M's. Yeah. Yeah, dude. That's nice. <laughs> Fuck the two M's, you know? Yeah. Forbidden M and M's. You yeah. mustn't. You mustn't. <laughs> Ugh. Ugh. He he yeah. also had a, a hard shell around him. He was he was uh well he had a kind of a permafrost of crust on him. He'd been yeah, busy. You know. I I only think maybe I maybe I had something to do with this. Maybe he's like a slow poke, you know? And oh. the uh yep. the shock of the Pringles can finally took him. <laughs> <laughs> he, you know, he just it, it now a, processed it, took, it. It took damn near, uh, damn near eight months, but you know, it it finally hit him. There was a snake yep. in that wavy Moa burger can of Pringles. Yeah, dude, and you know those uh, <laughs> those those two brain cells, man, firing at all cylinders. You know, oh yeah, <laughs> just takes a while. They got to tag team it. Doing the best they can. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah. Well, uh, good luck with the lawsuit. Oh, I, I understand that. I have that's one a... other thing that I want to ask about. Y yes. Yes. If if our little boggy boy dies, does uh, does Steve get, like, uh, survivor's pay from his S SSI, or what's going on there? You know, he was asking about it. Scrapper Steve. He was asking a lot about it. Yeah, and, you know, he was digging around. Josh can't read, so any legal documents could have been slipped under there, you know? I wonder, do you think Steve may have played a part in this? I think Steve has played a part in many deaths. <laughs> He's trying to collect. He wants that SSI. He needs that money. He really he does. Is, you know, like, finding copper and stuff on the ground, man, it, it just, it, it's not a viable strategy for so long you know 
He's also uh, he drank antifreeze once, so he's uh, he's experienced. Really? Yes. There's I'm, a video why? where Cobra talks about it. If you go on Lolcal Go, look up antifreeze or I know because he, he mm-hmm. had like a spoon of it or something. He said oh. that he was gonna um, commit harikiri. This is Steve, and so he from drank Sudoku. some. Yeah, exactly. And drinks uh, just a tiny amount of antifreeze, and Cobra wasn't sweating it because it was just a spoonful, you know. Oh my god! Yeah, yeah. Th- there's some, there's something going on in Casper, man, that these people can drink antifreeze and be all right. I'll tell you what, they're just they're about to be bored to death, so they will do just do you, about anything for fun. Do you think that antifreeze? Do you think that's better than the water? In Casper, <laughs> oh, we need to study that water. I have no idea yeah, what man. it's like. There's got to be something floating in it. I'm gonna get some people on that too. You know, get a crew, Just, uh, get a team. Get, get it's gonna be well water and test it. You know, we might see a little bit of Josh swimming in it in the microscope. His his boys, yeah. He's got a lot of boys in yeah. that water. I think this just got upgraded to class action lawsuit. Oh yeah, oh yeah, dude. We're, I, you don't understand. We have all the experience here. We're suing everyone, Caesar. Oh, all right. It's a free for all. Yeah. Battle royale. The problem royale. is you're gonna you're gonna see my nose enter the room before you see me, so that might uh, hurt my chances with the jury. You know. Not very stealthy, are you? Just put on a, a Groucho yeah. Marx mask. That'll uh, that'll take care of it. It might. It, 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 it would be an improvement on the nose area for sure. <laughs> But it would make it harder to smell the money. Tell you what, you know what, let's cool it with the anti-Semitic remarks, okay? No, they're not (laughs) anti-Semitic. I'm gonna, I I have the 2% big nose jeans, buddy. 2%? Like like milk? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, like 2% milk. I don't like this. But from that, from that Jewish area, though. Go, go collect some water samples, will ya? See how many of his boys are in there. I, I, I will, and I hope I don't get like suplexed by Clint when I go to Casper. You know, <laughs> he's he's pissed off. He's really angry right oh, now. Oh yeah, he's thirsting for blood. So yeah, he's gonna he give is, you dude. the the German suplex of your life. He's really hard right now. He's the hardest guy I've ever seen. Dude, hard and hard nipples and everything. Everything. Dude. Rock solid, thick, and tight. <laughs> All right. Ugh. See ya. Think about that for a while. Gorilla. Chew on that. We'll keep this going for a little while. Hang on, boy. Hang on. Silverback Gorilla Clint Hotline. Hey, how's it going? Hey. It's Seizure Robot. Who the hell is this? It's it's Seizure Robot. What are no. you calling me for, Butt Munch? Uh, butt Munch. You? We got you. We got Cobra in a coma. What do you? Uh, we got you got some nice things uh, to say about shooting John. imitation yeah. of Seizure Robot Five Thousand. I know. I know. <laughs> When I have heard a bootleg, hey, hey I'll, bootleg I'll not let you call into grub. my show. I'm Blech. gonna flush you. Well, Mine, you're, you're gonna get flushed, butt bunch. That's right. Give yourself a mercy kill. You couldn't get laid if you were inside of a chicken's ass. Mm-hmm. Need to get uh, need to get Bart Farkas to open up the lines. Where's my calls? Where are they? We got some voicemails. All right, all right. Let's let's do some voicemails. 
Here we go. Voice mails. Hey, so like I'm a listener mm -hmm. like twice only because my husband listens in and like just call me back. You are a shrill shrieking shrew who wants to get on my balls. Your answer is no. It's Mr. South. Mr. South. Mm. And I don't understand the anti-Semitism for our good friends up north from the great empire state of New York. Yep. I love all them boys from up there. Oh. They eat that pastrami, that Yankee barbecue. Mm. Mm. All right. Hey, Siege. I know our friend is in recovery, our little boy, but I'd love to talk about some uh, boglum cooking. Uh, hit me back up, 573-279. Oh, man, um, I was just calling because I wanted to, uh, you know, give my thoughts and prayers to uh, oh. his family in this hard time. Uh, I'm to understand that he's passed away due to he's still alive. alcohol and Listen or Dorito related uh, illness and yeah. injury. Yeah. Um, I just wanted to say that um, he ruled my life there for about 10 years. And no, he's still got a firm hold on me. I, I don't know what I'm going to do without him. He rules my it life. It would probably be uh, hear that, John? healthy for me. Uh, you hear that? So, they need you, buddy. Uh, big ups they need you. Down there in hell. Um, yeah. Well, Saunders, you're next. <laughs> oh, no. Hey. Mm. Shit. Hey, that's a keeper. I like that one. Let's hear that again. Shit. Yeah. Fuck you, dude. You're not even the real seizure robot. Yes, I am. I will thank you to call me that. Oh, I know this one. Ah, there he is. Gave me a tutorial and everything. Is this Belgian boy? All right, let me let me find the tutorial real quick. This guy really, really wants to get in. My goodness. Let me find the tutorial. Tommy, oh, oh my goodness, dial 11, dial 32, and then dial the number. All right, let's try this out. Jeez. Hang on. Let's see if we can escape the U.S. No, it, it won't. <laughs> this, uh, this Google Voice, if I even just dial 011 or 11... It is not having it. Um, let me try the full range. Here's something. Could not complete your call. No. Nope. Please try again. Damn. Gosh, it seems like it is at least trying to accept it, but it, it doesn't want to take it. I'm, I'm pretty sure that's a Belgian number. Anyway, let's take some calls. Who is this pounding away? Look at this. Aloha, this is Jamie Clark. You're clogging up my lines. I see you. Grinding up my lines. Aloha. Okay, okay. Uh.
She's clogging up my lines. Stop. She's clogging up my lines. Hey. Excuse me. Oh. Hello. Hello. Who is this? This is uh, Attorney Scott Miller from down here in Delray. Uh, oh, you're going to uh... need to pull that plug on that boy right now. He has a uh, do not resuscitate, and uh, you can't be keeping him alive. Uh, was this uh, do not resuscitate, was it handed to you by a bald man who was kind of scary? Uh, it was actually sent talking. down with, uh, in a package with the payment of 12 eggs along with a uh, wand. Uh, a, little, oh. a little dirty, but, a little uh, dirty. you know... You know, it had the signatures and all. You're, you're just going to have to pull it. You can't keep them here. Oh, oh no. I think I'd have to get it from uh, Clint or somebody. I, uh... Well, well, what's your, what's your fax number? I'll send it over right now. <laughs> I'll, uh, I'm going to text it to you, okay? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Good to you. All right. We're, we ain't pulling it just yet. I know you want to kill him, <laughs> but we're keeping him alive. All right, see you. All Shame right, have on a good you. Night, bud. See good night. Pulling a plug. Pull the plug on my ass. This is a support line. We're here to support Cobra, and you're talking about pulling the plug on him. You're talking about saving money and tax dollars. That person just gave up right away. Try to answer. Try to pick up the phone. They don't pick up. Who is this? Who the fuck is this? Hey, watch your mouth. This is a Christian call-in. Oh, my God. Yeah. We practice Christian values here, okay? I'm so sorry. Yeah. I'll thank you to apologize. What can I do for you? I can't believe this. Yeah. My walnut is so wet. Ah, yes. Yes. Like a geyser? Oh, yes. Yeah. 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 Got, that, got that slow drip going. Oh, Mr. Coffee. Oh, yeah, Action. buddy. Yeah? Yeah. Ugh. Yeah. How, how many pounds listen, are you? Listen, listen, Changer, I gotta... <laughs> <laughs> I gotta be... I gotta be real for a second. Yes. I love you so much, and your laugh... Makes me smile every time, and it's the best laugh I've ever heard. Oh, that's lovely. Thank you. Thank you. Real real and, talk. And I, I like to hear that. That makes me feel good. Yeah. What about Cobra's laugh? Do you like his laugh, too? I mean, when, when we're talking about Josh, I think his everything is kind of a top-tier situation. Mm, it's hard to compare. Yeah, yeah. Definitely. He is mm. the gothic bad boy. The gothic bad boy. Gold standard. Yeah. Indeed, indeed. I, I mean, nobody else can eat that many fucking eggs. <laughs> that, that laugh he does when he's uh, bravely uh, laughing at, at jokes that are at his expense. You know the noise? <laughs> Is that one? It's, it's magical. Yeah, yeah. Do you, are, you, are you able to do that laugh? I've been working on mine. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Kind of uh, sounds like a, a hungry cat or something. <laughs> not bad. Hey, not I, bad. I, tried, I tried my best. I'm on the spot, you know. It's not easy. You got the uh, maybe like a, a Danny Filth uh, shriek. Those are amazing too. Yeah, I love I was, those. I was gonna, I was gonna ask if I could, I could do one of those before oh. I had left you. How how loud can you go? Uh, well, let, let me try. Okay. <clears throat> Wow. Oh, you're talented. Uh, I didn't realize I was talking to Danny Filth. Do you have him in the room or something? I think, you know, he's my uncle. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So I think it runs in the family. My dad works for Nintendo. Did you know that? Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 Yes. Yeah, buddy. That's what's up. Uh, I can see the color returning to his soft, young spring chicken face. 
He's you, looking great. He is revitalized, uh, just resting comfortably. I think he's going to pull through. I'm so glad. I was really worried about our boy. I think, I think we need him. We need him in our lives. I can't live without him. He, he rules my I, life. I can't either. Lives in my head I rent-free. Can't. He rules my life. Yeah. Think about him constantly. I mean, what, is, what is he doing? What is he up to? I'm just glad we can relate on that. It's good oh, yeah. Alone. Yeah. Thank, this thank is. Thank God for the Cobra verse. We I, have mean, a, I mean. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. True understanding. We're like family. Indeed. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Well, uh, thanks for the well wishes and encouragement. I uh, really do appreciate it. <laughs> Hey, thank you. You have no idea. You've made my life. Oh, your whole life. This is it. The only thing that would be better is meeting the king himself. Well, hang on one second here. Do what? (laughs) You're going to have to repeat that. I just, I, you know, meeting Josh himself would be the only thing to top this. Oh, yeah, you and Daisy. Are you in cahoots with her? With Daisy? I, I'm i not in cahoots with Daisy, but we might have a lot in common. You've both got the hots for all Cobra. <laughs> you want to get <laughs> the Cobra's venom. Definitely want to try to play an occupation, you know? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> there needs to be a convention where all you fine ladies cluster together and Casper and just sing his praises and uh, you, know, you can just get in a big pile with him. How's that sound? Oh my gosh, a big pile? We could show up to his place with a boombox just playing Ozzy. <laughs> immediately start taking your clothes off. <laughs> he'll, he'll disrobe immediately. He'll, he won't ask any questions. You come in, pile oh, yeah. of women, playing Ozzy. And, uh, he'll, be, he'll be more than grateful. Oh yeah. He, he's going to say, well, I waited patiently. Finally it happened. Just had to wait. That's fact. That's what's up. <laughs> that is what's up. All right, baby. Catch you later. Bye bye, sexy. Mm. Mm. Yes. Hi, my name is Reggie Dingo. I'm with the United Parcel Service. We got a parcel we've been trying to deliver to a George Sandow. Oh, Reggie Dingo, uh, yeah. I, uh, please, sir, call me Reginald. I won't ask you again. Okay. All right, so we've sent our guy up there about three times already. Um, no one's been answering the door, but it's a COD from uh, well, funsizelovers.com. It's about a child-sized crate. I don't know what you're buying, but somebody's got to cover this. It's uh, $4,206.66 COD. Oh, Josh, listen. You you hear that? What's that? Oh, sorry. Uh, Josh, he's he's currently indisposed. That's why he hasn't been able to receive the package. He's in a coma for a variety of reasons. Oh, all right. Well, I I understand. I wish him a speedy recovery, but someone's got to cut us a check here. So if you can just uh, set me up with a credit card number, we'll uh, we'll get that squared away. Oh, a what number, Rangus? I'd like your credit card number so we can settle this COD. I mean, we got our drivers putting around wasting gas. Oh yeah, Josh. Josh, we need your debit card. I I think he got his taken away. Um. Hey, wait a second. This sounds kind of. This sounds a little fishy to me. Are you trying to trying to play a trick on me? Trying to fooly me? Sir, I assure you, there's no chicanery going on. You put out good bait. I'll give you that. I love child-sized sex dolls. Uh, the uh, the order slip says Felicia. I uh, I don't know what you get up to, sir. We just mm. want to get this thing off our truck. My guy's been driving around with it. It's taken up a lot of space. And uh, frankly, we're getting tired of coming back around up here. Tell you what, uh, I could help you send it to uh, Clint Saunders' house. Sir, There's you don't a... need to make up names. <laughs> Clearly a made-up name, right? <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like an asshole. Sounds like someone I need to go down and knock around a little. Yeah, maybe. Mm. 
Good luck with that. Well, well, uh, Rangus, we're gonna need I, that. Uh, uh, I, I, I'm afraid I don't know what to tell you. I don't have his uh, his debit card number, credit card. I, I want to get the package, well, store, right. but you can just give me yours. No, hey, quit it. Stop that. I knew it. I, 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 you want me to come to? Yeah, sir. I, if you can't cooperate, uh-huh. I'm gonna come down there with my four foot chain, and start swinging it around my head. Oh shit. I Rangus, got a burrow I can ride in on. Rangus, what was your last name? Reggie Dingo, sir. Oh, okay. Rank Rangus Dingus. Gotcha. Hey, I I can't help you. You ain't getting my credit card number. I need that money. I really do. I need that money. You ain't getting it. That's what they all say, sir. Yeah, try to tempt me with a sex doll. Shame on you. Well, I'm going to be there at 10 a.m., so uh, you just wake up bright and early. I don't know if you can't cut me that check. We're just going to have to throw hands. Throw hands. We're going to have to sort it out. Uh, going to knock you down. Why don't you hit that dusty trail and uh, come on over? I'll be waiting with bells on. Going to hit your lip. <laughs> your foot. <laughs> going to hit your lip. Is this Reggie Brungus? Excuse me? Oh, that's some guy trying to tempt me with a sex doll. In, in oh, well. really? really? Yeah. What kind of sex doll? Oh, it's one of those child-sized ones. You know the Felicia model? Oh, it's oh. Hot. no. Yeah. No, I don't think you want that. Oh, really? Sounded pretty good on paper, at least. Hey, listen, I'm worried yeah. about Cobra. All right. Ah, thank I wanted you. to leave by his apartment. See oh. what I could pick up for him, you know, when he wakes up. What should I pick up? Uh, oh, you want to get him like a, a care package or just like items from his apartment? Is that what you're saying? Well, I'm sure. Well, I mean, wouldn't he have like a favorite blanket or like a favorite pair of green panties or like a favorite tobacco pipe or something he'd want to wake up to? All right. Tell you what, he needs his men's vitality pills. Okay. You can start with that. Right. Okay. All right. All right, uh, let me hang on. Let me write all this down. Hang on. Okay. All right, men's vitality pills. He needs um, G fuel. Okay. A couple Pulled scoops up. of that. Uh, whatever he's got left, you, you might have to kind of scrape whatever's left at the bottom. That that grimy residue at the bottom of the tub. But I think he's got okay. some left over. Okay. Um, and definitely some soap, correct? What's that? Definitely some soap. Uh oh yeah yeah he um. You know, he's been getting I'll these get sponge slippers. baths, I'll get, but they don't I'll get have tactical box of soap. soap slippers. Yeah. They don't have any at the hospital when they're giving him the sponge bath. He needs the tactical oh. soap. Okay. Do you have a hazmat then, uh, suit? Should I get this weird uh, green spice looking stuff on his counter that says uh, super duper cannabinoid spice? Now hold the phone. You're in there already? Yeah, yeah. Are you wearing protective gear? No. No, what? I mean, why would I? Listen, there's something see, incredibly I'm, hazardous in there. I'm, I'm feeling a little lightheaded. I'm going to be do honest. You, I don't... Do you see a little dummy in there, a little puppet? No. I, oh, God. I see demons. Oh, no. Dark, stinky demons that resemble you ever, cigarette butts. You ever see the movie 1408? John Cusack, the hotel room uh, you can't get out of. Help me, seizure. You're in deep, Please my help friend. Me. I'm sorry. You're help in me. Sean's lair now. I can't help you now, buddy. Send Chauncey. <laughs> yes. Hello. Hello? Hey. Who am I speaking to? This is Snake Bow. Is, is this King Cobra? No. Is this King Cobra? I wish. He's sleeping. Uh, first first time caller, long time listener. I'm uh, glad to get on the air. Oh, yeah. Welcome, welcome. Cobra's in a coma. I uh, actually... Oh, I, that's the first I've heard of this. Actually, I just tuned in like literally two minutes ago. Ah, yes, yes. Ah, uh, he's seen better days. Is our boy doing okay? 
Well, he's he's sleeping it off. He uh, drank a few bags of ZZ Quill, a bunch of eggs, some dog medicine. He's not doing so hot. I think he needs to uh, start investing in some uh, some gravel. I, I think that would be right up his alley. What the hell is that? It's diphenhydramine. It's it's almost like an uh, anti-allergy medication, but oh. people use it as like a sleep aid, I guess. So oh, you should get on that pretty thing. heavy. That'd be good for him. No way. He needs a he no. That's the first up. thing he needs. He needs the non-drowsy. That's the first thing right he needs. Now. First thing. He needs to put me down, not to pick me up. He needs to put me down. You're trying to kill him. I'm going to join Scotty I don't think I could do any worse than he's already doing to himself. Oh, boy. I don't like this. (laughs) Anyway, I just wanted to say thanks for doing what you do, and I listen to your streams every night. Hell, yeah. Well, I wish you could have brought some better energy, but I appreciate it. I want to praise. Oh? I want a circle of protection right now. Give it to me, Daddy. Hey, Mr. Big Boy, you need some uh, forgiveness blessing before you get any protection. You come in here stinking up this joint, talking about giving him even more drowsy formula. Um, Mm. Would you believe me if I said that my ex-girlfriend dumped me because of King Cobra? I would believe that. That's a bummer. Because I paid more attention to him than I did to her. Is that for real? Yeah, that's for real. Literally, like a year ago. <laughs> so they hate him. The women hate. I well, I, uh, the the non golf women. I told her. I said, "Yeah, you're." Pro- <laughs> it's funny because uh, I told her. I said, "Yeah, you're probably just going to start obsessing over him now." And guess what? That's the exact thing. That's the exact thing that happened. So There's not enough room. Kind of ironic. Cobra and that no, there that isn't. Whatever you want to call this partner of yours, sounds like she <laughs> wasn't worth it to me. Good no riddance. Way. Yeah. <laughs> No way I'd be sharing a bed with both of them, that's for sure. I must warn you, you might be in for a four-year dry spell. Because uh, sometimes <laughs> like a you... a four-day you... dry spell for me. <laughs> oh, wow. Big words, big words. You watch it, mister. One of these days, your hair's going to fall out. You're uh, you're not going to be as charismatic. Uh, you're going to be that. running on two brain cells. Don't say that. Oh, you might get the cobra's curse, my friend. Got to. I think I already have man. it. To be honest with you, <laughs> it has begun. Yeah. You're going to start the metamorphosis. Uh, anyway, man, the I just want to say thanks. Anytime, anytime. Good to have. I you. already am about the boggle. <laughs> yeah, you too. Anyway, thanks for uh, streaming. It's pretty entertaining. Yeah, anytime, anytime. I uh, I work nights, so it's good to listen to you at nighttime. Oh Gets yeah, through my shift. So no, it is uh, pretty handy for that. Anyway, it I just want to say thanks to the Reverse. Thank you. Yes, sir. Beat it. Oh my god, it's so entertaining. Man. Hang on. Oh. Someone sent me a text message saying this is Sean. Call me. I'm really curious about that one. We'll uh, we'll get on that. Sean. Cool taste. Uh, is this uh, the number for uh, that Caesar robot uh, guy? Yeah. Is this the where you talk about Josh Hotline? It's the talk about Josh Hotline. Mm. We're trying to give him good feelings, good thoughts and prayers. Oh, oh listen yeah. To you, yeah. <laughs> yeah. That sounds, that sounds pretty good. You know, I got you just got a hot gas. <laughs> <escape>. <laughs> yeah. Oh, so good. Yeah. Um, yeah, that guy guy knows how to party. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Uh, I'm take some notes. I've been on a real bender uh, tonight. Mm-hmm. What you been drinking? Uh, uh, Cobra's Mist. Oh, yeah. That's the hard stuff, huh? Oh, yeah. Take a sip. Uh, take a sip. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, You're yeah, that's good. Yeah, that's really yeah. good. Man, he's... Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, like a true cobra. 
You, you're putting them down. You got the you got the burps. What else are you gonna drink tonight? Uh, I don't know. I've been going through the list. I, All the comments. I need to go out and like get some more alcohol. Yeah. Like I can probably drive to you. What time is it? It's like uh, what, uh, two, uh, two o'clock. Yeah, I can. I can make that. I can make it out to the store. No, you can do it. I what do you want? Yeah, what do you want? <laughs> what do you want? I want. Can you get me a Cobra's blood? Uh, what, what, what's in that? It's uh, it's a Pontic Red and Monster. Okay. Give me that. You, you know my. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Don't laugh at me. I'm sorry. You got some some gastric juices coming up out of there, man. You are you're a trip. You need some Pepto Bismol while you're at it. Settle that stomach of the indigestion. <laughs> <laughs> oh, how, you just a big old big old thing of hot gas, aren't you? Just swollen up, just ballooning. Oh up. yeah, just a big fat no. guy. I like, I like, uh, can, can you, uh, yeah. <laughs> can you mix Pepto Bismol? Oh, yeah. We need, that needs to be the new Cobra combo Pepto Bismol and, I don't know, Blue Moon. Uh, call Light, it a uh, platinum. <laughs> call it the Pink Snake. Mm. <laughs> call it Cobra's Gums. Cobra's gums, good and pink. Get some weird crap swirling up in there. Yeah, yeah. Some yeast, some uh, some bacteria, some strains. Maybe let it ferment a little bit, like fermented Pepto Bismol. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Well, um, go get me a Cobra's blood. I need to uh, see if I can get in contact with Sean. Um, I need to make sure he doesn't get mad at me. Absolutely. Uh, right. Thanks, Cobra's magic. Yep. Uh, praise is magic. Uh, good night. Uh, good, night. Uh, good night. Good night. All right. Let's see if this is the real Sean. Oh, wow. Okay. <laughs> uh, I think this is the equivalent of our fax line. I think this is the first set of photos I've ever gotten. Uh, I'm going to call Sean, but I just got a couple of uh, really great pictures here. And it is, um, one of them is Cobra's butthole. Uh, he asked me to describe his anus in detail. Well, okay. Um... Uh, up above, there's a there's something there. There's um, some kind of cyst that you can develop right below your tailbone. It looks like maybe he had uh, corrective surgery for that at some point because there's a big vertical red line. It's like a second uh, like butthole above his butthole. Um, below that, it's oh god, this is disgusting. Kind of looks like carp lips. Um, surrounded by hair, there's a gray ring around it. Uh, quite a bit of discoloration. But he is like, it looks painful how hard he's spreading these things. Pretty, pretty gross. And um, he was tricked into sending this to an of age female who claimed that they really wanted to see uh, the, the Valley of the Cobra. It's. It really does look like uh, two puckered lips. Pretty rotten to the core. Uh, I wouldn't wish this on anybody. I seriously got this in my Google Voice text messages. That is some innovation. Um, well done. Uh, pe periodontal cyst. Yeah, that's the one. It is a sinus that gets filled with sebum, dead skin, and oil. So it's just like a, a collection, uh, like a reservoir for all that crap. I got you. And also uh, got sent a picture of his penis. It it uh, I wonder if I can get his face 
that he's making here um, without getting the dong. It's a really funny face that he makes. Yeah, that'll do. You don't know what the other part is. It's okay. It's kind of like when I showed his um, the the texture of the end of his dong, and you, you don't know what you're seeing. Let's uh, call him George Dongus. I will post this here. One sec. Uh, Josh, I hope you're not hearing this. Don't worry. Maybe he likes this. Maybe this will give him good energy. But. Uh, Oh, it's doing that thing again. One sec. Make make an account. Time well spent. This is uh this is what they want. There we go. Yeah. <laughs> Let me see if I can help it blend in just a tiny bit more. Um Okay, that's the first thing to come in. All right. Um, not what I was hoping for. Uh, how's that looking? He sort of blends in there. Not bad. All right. Uh, we'll just leave it like that. So let's see if we can get uh, Sean in here. This is Sean. Call me. Okay. I'm nervous. Hello? Is this Sean? Well, well. Ooh. If it isn't the famous seizure robot. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, this is him. Uh, you touched my boy without my permission. Sean, I'm sorry. Putting your hands all over him. No. Trying to revive him no, from his coma. No, it's not true. That's not true. Don't you know that's mm. off-limits meat? He belongs to me. Sean, I need you to release the man who came into the apartment, okay? You need to let him go. Well, I'm going to need to know what's in it for me. Oh, God. Um, what are you going to do for me, Seizure? Uh -huh. There's there was a man who was uh, promising to deliver Felicia. Would you like that? Would you like another Felicia? I don't know. Saw the way he slapped her butt. It's pretty funny. It seemed I... like he enjoyed it. <laughs> yeah. A little. <laughs> I'll tell you what. Yeah. You. I'm listening. <laughs> Oh, God. I think the negotiation failed. <sighs> Sorry. Whoever that guy is that uh, wandered in there, I don't think we can save him. Forgiveness. Please. Please. Uh, let's see. We started at 9, 10, 11, 12. Okay. Um, think think I'm going to go over Donos, and we're going to wrap this up. I told myself that we would cap it. We have a Cobra cap at three hours. So, sorry to cut the fun short, cut it early, but I think three hours is a sweet spot. Uh, we'll be back. Um... Bear with me, I'm trying to find the Super Chats while I'm getting that for you guys. Uh, we will be doing a Valentine's stream. Uh, Zach! Zach gave a really nice Super Chat. Goth Moods, another exquisite banger from my favorite label. I'll take 42,069 copies. Keep up the amazing work. Love you. Mean it, Seizure. Thank you, Zach. Richard. It's your boy Richard, the Richard, Jordan expert. Enjoy a few brews on me. Also, I heard you day real talk 
laughing my ass off. I don't know what that means, Richard. Your boy Richard, the Richard Jordan expert. I don't get it. Yao Kbro says, that was my wife clogging up the line. Don't answer. She's not of age. Hey, I didn't know that. You can't, you can't trap me, all right? It's entrapment. I didn't know. Wendy asks, who will be the lucky lady with you on stream this year, boy? Um, I'm not sure. I actually don't have any guests <laughs> lined up at this moment. I'm going to be seeing who I can collect. And there's going to be another RNG mechanic involved. I was thinking uh, last year we did Cobra's past girlfriends. If I can get enough of them, because there's been quite a few, I could get his internet honeys and see who you get uh, when you roll for it. So there's, of course, Spooky Girl. There's uh, Chaz's Girl. I'd love to get a picture of this other Daisy. There's... Um, one one lady who appeared on his Facebook a long time ago. I'll get her. See if I can get enough contenders. But I want there to be kind of like a um, who you going to get scheme. If you haven't seen the uh, mechanics of the Valentine's Day stream, check it out. It's pretty funny. Uh, I really enjoyed being able to like set that up. It really is random. You don't know what you're going to get. Poot Hauer says Poot Gang represent. Wendy says, better not be me, boy. Wendy, you have so much energy. I, I think I could bring you in for a little while. Just like a real concentrated uh, dose of Wendy. Oh, God. I legitimately struggle to keep up with you. I need processing time. Uh, there's like a three-second delay for me to comprehend the words that come out of your mouth. Oh, man, Gothic D, she'd be an awesome internet uh, girlfriend to potentially roll. That's a great idea. Gothic D interview, I doubt she'd want to talk to me, but that'd be really fun. She's, she's a true goth. She's one of the last few remaining. Boglum Chronicles says, try to track down Josh's real mom and get her on. I'm sure she's a real beaut. Oh, Laura. I bet she's scary, to be honest with you. I don't want to mess with her. Five minutes or less, boy, says Wendy. Yeah. I'll have you on for longer than that. That's A-OK. -okay. Yeah, yeah. Um, I've got your email. We can chat it up. I think it'd be awesome to have you on there. Get me a, um, get me a Canon photo of Wendy, and you can be one of the roles that people can get. But that... Uh, I think it would be more fun to do that on the weekend versus actual Valentine's Day because I think Valentine's falls on a Tuesday or something. If I can get... I think you meant to say trapped. If I can get trapped for you, would you do that interview? Um, uh, I would talk to him, sure. I think that guy, from what I've heard, wants nothing to do with the Cobraverse. He is incredibly disappointed with uh, Josh and just doesn't like to talk about him at all. Mm -mm 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 -mm. People are saying, one more hour, boy. Mm. I told myself three hours. It is tempting to just keep it up. I think, I think three hours, short and sweet. While we're on a high note, you know, we saw Josh's dong sort of in his face. Clear view. Answer the phone. No. No. Four hours would be perfect. Just not five hours. Mm. 
Three and four are those magic numbers. Let's out pull the plug. Another half hour. Okay, okay. That that is a good compromise. Uh, we'll do we'll do thirty more minutes. That's a compromise. I can get down with that. Let's open up those lines. Open up those lines. There we go. All right, we need a gauntlet. We're gonna do a gauntlet. This is a uh, the Save Cobra home stretch. Yes, caller, you are live. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, buddy. Uh, this is the uh, the guy who called in the last week. I was trying to get myself onto the customer support because I was turning into a bog. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Dude, you saved my life. You did great. You we saved my life. I, I, had a, um, I had a date. Oh, I had a date with date. an of-age female. Yeah. And I did not want to show up as a cobra. So I, I, I well, bless your magic, man. I'm sure you had the uh, Harry the, Potter shirt ready with the mackerel juice on it, but then you knew better. Said, oh, I'm not going to wear this. Yeah, I had to remove Ozzy from my knuckles after that. Oh. I had to go ahead and go to the tattoo parlor and be like, um, can we just uh, turn this into a uh, one of those stuzzy S's? Well, you know. So that way when I put my fingers together, it could turn into an S. It's like those guys that get Nazi tattoos all over their head and they do it for free so that they can. <laughs> oh. Oh. Pardon me. So they can uh, return to society. Uh, they, they, you know, do it free of charge. Right. I, I hear there's guys out there who will eliminate the Aussie knuckles for you when you're trying to uh, get yeah, back on the straight uh, narrow. Yeah, they ended up turning into um, the OZZY. They ended up um, turning it into a Stuzzy, but then they're like, oh, may, maybe that might not work out, but then they just ended up putting FAG on it, but Oh. I don't know if that's uh, any better. Because yeah, that uh, that doesn't sound too good. Are you sure you're not still a boglum? I don't know, man. I, this is why I should not mess around with black magic, you know? Yeah. The, the, I've learned my lesson. It backfires. Well, and if I was uh, Cobra's, Cobra's son, I'm pretty sure he would make me, I don't know, drink the... The, the ink or something. They make you drink Teach a King Cobra. Lesson. What you're gonna do? You're gonna be drinking down his boys. You're gonna be guzzling down those <laughs> boys. Is that like the Chris Chan Fanta? It is. It is. It's Monster and Josh's oh. semen. Yes. It's the King Cobra. Does it have 99 proof bananas? I mean, that might wash it down a bit. It, it might help the taste, but I'm afraid not. You're gonna be drinking kind of a bleachy monster. Oh my gosh. Yeah. So, uh, why don't you think about that for a little while as you uh, continue your journey of not being a boglum? Okay. I'm, I'm really trying to stay away from all the uh, the dark magic, you know? Stay I'm, away. It, if, it keeps if you, getting uh, worse and worse. There's support groups out there that you can get with. Don't, don't fall back into temptation, okay? Okay, that was. I'll try. All right, friend. Bye now. Don't become a boggling, friends. Don't be the boggle. Don't be a boggle. Mm. Check our voicemails while we have this opportunity. Pick up your phone, boy. No! Don't tell me what to do! Um... Uh, no. Yes. Hello? Hey, don't tell me to pick up my phone. I'll do what I want, okay? 
That's good. That You're getting well me real steam now. I am. Yeah. You got me all fucked up right now. Yeah, you got me real angry. And you've been uh, pounding back a few Cobra's mists, friend? Of course. Yes. Every night. Yes. What are you, what are you... <laughs> Every night. Got that uh, room temperature Bud Light Platinum going as well. Shook it till it was flat. Yeah. Get it good and flat. That's when it tastes the best. I want it to be warm. When it waffles up to my nose, I want it to smell like old throw up. That's when you know it's ready to drink. Oh, yeah. Now, I try to make sure I get a little bit on the rug. So yeah. Oh, yeah. Pour one out for the homies. Absolute. Yeah. A little one for uh, homeboy Scotty. All right. Mm-hmm. Rest in peace. Play a room skate. I have a. Yeah. Absolute. Yeah. Yeah. So I, I have a quick question that I've kind of wanted to discuss with anybody relative to the uh, Cobra verse here. Mm. It's. um. Does Josh, does Clint have a responsibility for Josh? This is something that's really been bothering me. Is as a man on his own, does Clint have an obligation to constantly take care of him? On paper, no. Mm-hmm. Um, legally, and he plays his card all the time. Josh is eighteen; he doesn't have to. It all depends on how much you actually care about your boy um it's it's up to the individual right Mm -hmm. no i i I see that i just yeah i i feel for clint in some regard of just pure exhaustion yeah yeah you know like how much can one man take i mean he had to have been done with this shit at 16 probably when josh was medicated and in school and had basic structure surrounding his life. Yeah. No, Josh has fought him every step of the way on really menial things, like changing his socks. Uh, There's been battles. Eh? Doing the fucking dishes. (laughs) Yeah, yeah, yeah. I just, I, I, I hear people talking all the time about, you know, how Clint needs to do more and be more involved, but... Mm -hmm. He's also about to turn 31, and he only becomes more of a nightmare as time progresses. It's it's true. There may have come a point, and I think a lot of people in that position, kind of like uh, kids who grow up with nasty parents, and they, they get older, and they say, all right, this is it. F you. I'm cutting all ties. Uh, mm-hmm. I think possibly as a father you get to a point where it's like, listen, you have stepped on my toes so many times. You've refused my help. You've been an absolute nightmare. Uh, I'm going to let you go. And just, like, I'm, I'm sick of this. I, I, I yeah, can see no, that. Like I, I, I just, I don't, yeah, I, I mean, considering how much of a fucking nightmare Josh has been and how much he has fought Clint throughout the years, mm-hmm. I have to give Clint credit for how much he still tries to be involved like the effort he still actively puts in you know he keeps him off the street keeps him contained yeah i'm i, I that's those are some pretty big points i mean <laughs> without clint all of this falls apart immediately yes you know? no uh josh man it's it's interesting to imagine because i'm pretty sure that uh the agreement is Clint takes care of Josh's uh, SSI and the, the money that yeah, comes in. Pay, right? I think so, yeah. Because mm. otherwise, uh, you know Josh would not be able to pay his bills and might even no. get evicted because he is so bad with money. That's, that's like He overdrafts constantly, and I'm pretty sure it's just Clint picking him up on the back end, him trying to eat the fees where he can, but Largely, it's reaching out and trying to get some good old-fashioned Clint bucks. Yeah, yeah. What's your that, so your your take? You're thinking that Clint maybe gets a bad rap for uh, what he does. That maybe he gets a little too much blame given his situation. Absolutely. I, I just okay. Okay. and and I I understand where a lot of people come from. Um, you know, I. I get why people do say like oh he could do more 
but I feel like he doesn't get credit for what he does do and for how much he kind of actively contributes to Josh's life on a very basic level. I got you. We need we need a little bit of devil's advocate here. Give uh, gotta, gotta, pay Clint some up. compliments. You know, somebody's yeah. got to be on his side, right? Yeah. Here, uh, he'll let you jump on his back. You just hop on there. He'll he'll give you rides. Big strong that man. Up. Get on that gorilla's back. Yeah, yeah. That sounds like a pretty hot time. Actually. Sounds sounds like a great time. Yeah. Well, uh, I think well, I have a call from Clint. I'm gonna call him back. Well, well maybe we Get can him. follow up on this conversation here with Mr. Clint himself. Call Clint, continue this, and then call me back after. All right, you got it. All right, man. Have a good See night. You. Let's have a listen here. I'm gonna. I'm a little skeptical. See if this is a convincing Clint. Oh, no. Nope. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Let's see if I can get this number afterward. I want Clint. Let's see. Let's have a listen. More voicemails. All right. Hey, uh, this is uh, Clint. Call me back. That does not sound like Clint. Maybe it's the Google voice. I'm going to blame it on the Google voice. Let's call Clint. Big Daddy. Hello? Hey, is this Papa Clint? Yeah, this is Clint. Well, Papa Bear... Yeah, you're talking to me? Yeah, yeah. I hear you're uh, talking about my fucking son on your yeah. stupid fucking channel. Yeah, Papa Bear. Yeah, you sound a little... You fucking dipshit? you a little hot around the collar there, huh, Clint? Yeah, I get real steam when fucking knuckleheads like you yeah. go on live on your YouTube and yeah. talk about my fucking stupid kid. Yeah, you're coming in hot, Clint. You're coming in hot. I've been wearing wanna, a fucking a shitty polo around. all day. Yeah. It's fabric fucking coarse. Uh -huh. And it's been fucking grinding my nipples down all fucking day. And I fucking have to come home and listen to you talk shit about my fucking stupid kid. You need some ointment for those nipples. Uh, it's chafing. You got a lot of chafing going on there, Clint. You need to wear I got looser clothes, all right? Listen, pal. Listen, pal. I don't need a fucking... You don't, you don't you, need advice from me, Clint? Listen, you're sitting here fucking making money off of my good name, and you're not sending me one red cent. Oh, oh yeah, Clint. Yeah, a bunch your of true fucking, character's you're coming fucking out. Knucklehead. I, uh, Calling in. Tell you what, I'll send you some money so you can get a couple of, of piercings, and uh, you can get a nice chain to connect those two nipples. How's that sound? <laughs> 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 Sound good, Clint? I think you're coming yeah, around. Not? Yeah, yeah. I, I think I won you over. Yeah, you're talking my language. Yeah, yeah. Uh, you, you and Josh can, you can get <laughs> father son. <laughs> you can get father son nipple piercings. How's that? Sound? Yeah, you gotta keep them on a short leash. You can hold hands uh, during. Yeah, that's a little short little nipple leash. We'll, uh, we'll bonding Keep experience. that boy from wandering too far. Uh, put on your, your cool biker gear, <laughs> too, all right? Yeah. Yep, and, yep. Uh, no one will mess with you when when you and your boy walk down that street. You got them on a leash connected directly to his nipples. Uh, don't mess with them. Those are the Saunders boys. Yeah, he's boys. not going to get any trouble when he's, uh, That's... he's, uh, he's, uh, <laughs> Saunders and off the <laughs> <laughs> wearing your your officer's hats or whatever they are the, the biker hats made out of leather this uh those are some yeah. tough dudes you got to be tough to get father son nipple piercings no and, you really don't want to fuck with that no no clint i'm i'm glad that we could establish a friendship um uh, it didn't take much you, you and your boy have a weakness for gifts uh i gotta yeah, say well <laughs> 
we Go love on. the goodies. We love getting uh, we love getting some attention. From, yeah. Uh, yeah. From oh. big shots like you. Yeah. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. You know, win you over. You, you came in hot. You are talking a, a real <laughs> tough game, but that's uh, nah, all right. I'm, I'm glad we could be friends. Oh, Papa Bear, Clint. Yeah, it's a it's a small world and uh, not time in this life to hold grudges like that. That's right. That's right. Remember to uh, c- could you post some more pictures of your face on Facebook talking about how you're grateful? Could you do that for me? I, uh, I've been working on another fucking picture of myself pooping on the fucking toilet. Oh yeah. When I get that done, I'll work on getting some more pictures on my face up. But that's gonna, right. that's gonna take a couple. That's gonna take a little bit. More inspirational quotes, please. We need reminders to be grateful. <laughs> All right, Clint. All right. Give your son a hug for me. All right. He's he's not well. Will do. All right. Bye bye. And- <laughs> well, that was um, that was definitely Clint. About time you picked up, boy. Boy, who's this? This is Janoy Kresva from uh, the frothy piss lakes of uh, Lake Kresva. Oh, okay. Can you hear me all right? Oh, I can hear you great. So uh, I wanted to pick your brain. Uh, first off, long time fan. This is my second time calling. Mm. Um, I, I I don't know if you've noticed, but uh, a lot of these bigger channels are starting to focus in on low cows. Um, like Bass Shaman, uh, Pot Awful. Yeah, so... I'd like to, kinda... to take a moment to talk about uh, Bass Shaman's fine merch you can get on Amazon. Have you seen that stuff? I haven't. Please, uh, please elaborate. Oh, it's great. Let me, uh, let me get that rigged up real quick. Uh, he's got some nice wares. Uh... Uh, while I'm pulling that up, continue. What other what other great uh, YouTube people are talking about Josh now? Uh, well, so it's it's uh, they're not talking about him yet. Um, oh yeah. I don't know if you're from, I don't know I don't know if you're familiar with Cyrax. Um, yes. So they they've caught on to Cyrax and they're involved with people like Courtney. So I feel like they're getting close, um, which kind of leads me to wonder if all this attention that's being placed on like people like Cyrax who. Um, if you, if you look at his streams now, it's like a lot of, a lot of negative, you know, people fucking with him. Um, like, you know, what happens when that comes to Josh? I'm not saying there's going to be negative, but it's going to be, I think it's people just, there's going to be a lot more pay pigs giving him oh. money to see him do stupid shit. Mm-hmm. So I'm wondering if we're going to see maybe even more of like a spiral saga. Yeah. There's, um, um the era that we've, we've been in for a while and, uh, I, I was getting worried because I was concerned about kind of like the IP2 crowd coming in and being really vindictive and wanting to cause him misery. But if they're throwing mm-hmm. money at him, it's not a good thing for him, but at least it's not as malicious. Uh, I can definitely see the cycle of people wanting to give him money so that he'll get wasted. Uh, right, right. That will get way worse. Yeah. But I almost feel like too it'll be it would be beneficial. I'm not saying that you're trying to get your channel huge, but people are going to come to your videos. They're going to come to bite sizes videos. Um, I mean, Lots this is kind of what I'm seeing. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I, I just kind of see you can see it on the horizon. Um, and then the other thing too is I was curious if you heard about uh, uh, I guess a troll um, clipped some video of Courtney's tits and sent it to her work. <laughs> so, no, I hadn't heard about yeah. that. Yeah, so actually, uh, somebody sent me the clip, but um, she was on a stream with a guy known as Music Biz Marty. I don't know if you've ever heard of him. Um, no. Yeah, so he's a top tier troll, and she was wasted and flashed her tits at somebody for uh, for some shackles, and mm. they cl- somebody clipped it. Somebody from the Coververse. Or the, so they're blaming it on, clipped it, and then sent it to her boss. Yeah. So I guess she, I guess she's taking a little break. So I thought I'd throw that out there. For, oh damn! I don't. Yeah, I don't hate her personally. I know a lot of people do. 
Yeah. Um, I, I think I think she's pretty neutral, but uh, yeah, I just think that's kind of funny. Um, no, we got back at her. It is. I mean, without taking a, a hard stance on it, I'm not the biggest fan. I'm glad that she can sure. get in Josh's ear if there's an emergency, right? Right, um, right. She she has demonstrated in the past that she can prevent him from really going off the deep end with Chaz. She got real deep in that. But um, she's always been this kind of weird and vulnerable entity because her, her info's out there. You, you can find out where she works. Um, she's probably been doxxed already. But up till this point, no one has been able to humiliate her or get her to relent at all. Uh, this yeah. is the first case I know of. Well, yeah, somebody, uh, again, I, I saw the video and I won't get too descriptive, but you know, she pulls out her tits and licks them and sets them on beer cans and, uh, <laughs> yeah. Just Do a, a can crush with them. <laughs> she did a little can crush with them. Yeah. Swapping them around. Yeah. Um, they're, they're, they're not the best I've ever seen. We'll say that much. Well, but, that's uh, really yeah. disappointing news for you. What's that? Base shaman. He took down his shop on Amazon. Oh, uh, dang it! Um, I'm gonna buy his kick-ass yeah, really merch. Been, Continue. That's another thing too. You know, he's kind of. You guys both have radio voices. You know, uh, when I I don't really pay attention to him. I think he's kind of annoying. I'm 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 kind of like you. I'm an older gym bro, and uh, I know he used to kind of be in that scene too. Yeah. Um, yeah. But uh, yeah, no, not my cup of tea. But yeah, I just wanted to share that info. Uh, love your show. Keep doing what you're doing and uh, rock on, brother. Thank you. Thank you. And uh, right. peace out. Yeah, anytime. I don't like Bass Shaman. I'm not, I'm not the biggest fan. Uh, about that, I, I saw some of his older videos and he, he kind of showed his true form. If you go like, to the very beginning of his channel, He's a totally different guy when he's uh, speaking out of character. And I find him to be a little disingenuous. Yes. Hey. Hello? Hey, you want some based shaman merch? It's off the market. Oh, God. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> yes. Yes, cool. Hey, happy birthday. Guess whose birthday it is. It's, it's uh, only the greatest happy guy who has birthday teeth. birthday to me. Someone's got a birthday. Wonder who. Caesar, Someone's am I going to be able to take a couple calls this week? <laughs> yes. Yes, cool taste. Yeah? Yes. Yay. Yay. Uh, did you get any good presents? Yeah, oh, I got a couple good presents. Yeah. I got some KFC ketchup. <laughs> ketchup? Wait, did you say KFC and ketchup? Yeah, no, just <laughs> KFC ketchup. Oh, oh, okay. Is that pretty good? So, uh, it's the best ketchup and Casper. Hey, what what's up with the collab? Uh, I guess you didn't get to do it because... Cobra's in a coma. I'm sorry about that. Hopefully when he wakes up, you guys can work together. I think we're going to have to put a zero protection over him again tonight. Oh, hey, cool taste. Uh, you practice magic, my lord? No, like, you're going you're gonna to have to oh. we're gonna put a zero protection over him. I'm together. working on it. I'm working on it. I'm trying Using to both collect all the our, energy. Yeah. Our magic. Our magic. Yes, yes. Cool taste. Yes. Um, Caesar, why didn't you give me a call at the beginning of the podcast? Our podcast? You you mean this call and stream? Yeah, our podcast. Well, oh God, yes, our our podcast. I'm sorry. Um, I just want to let you know that we we are uh, ready to work together from here on out. It's just going to be uh, every future podcast episode is is going to be you and I working together. I wanted to make that clear. Um, and I'm sorry. Uh, for not calling you, I didn't. I didn't realize we made that agreement. I figured you just make your way in the way that you do. DJ, we made a promise last week, and you already broke it. Ah, uh, oh. Hey, everybody! It's me, your old school days. DJ promised I could take a couple calls this week. Yes, yes. 
Oh, so you want to talk to people? Yeah. Oh. You do. You don't really need your... Um, okay. Um, I, I, you know, we tried this before, Mr. Taste. And not going to work still? I, I don't think it works. I, I tried putting you on hold before and taking more calls. You need your... <sighs> yes? It's our podcast, though. I know. I know. You need to be patient with me, okay? Don't take my teeth. I'm right, fond of them. We're okay. going to put a circle of protection over King Cobra. Yes. He got only a giant, giant wing of Roman Goma. Yes. <laughs> Are you ready, oh, Junior? Yes, my lord. Do you have a, a screen somewhere nearby you? Oh, right in front of me. Big ol' screen. Okay, I'm gonna need you to lay both your hands and your, you know, your on your screen. Both, both my hands, you said. Yeah. Okay, and your okay, face yeah. on your screen. My face. On your face. Yeah. Okay. One second. One second. Let me get my mic so I'm close. One second here. Okay. Yes. All right. And we're gonna do it with all the power of me and with. Teach your robot and Cool Taste Podcast. With all the power of me and Cool Taste Podcast. And all of the awesome listeners. Hopefully it may judge get better and it may feel not better and it's trying to go mad in that coma and it's trying to be good and make sure he doesn't drink too much because he has a bad problem. Yes. You do, or are you going to repeat that? Um, uh, um, the, the, all the good, good manners in the good, uh, podcast. Yes. And now we sacrifice the cat. Oh, hey. Okay. Oh, no. Right? No. Cool taste, please. Nope. It doesn't have to come to that. Don't, don't hurt that precious little kitty. And with one cat sacrifice. Oh, God. Oh, God. King Homer will wing up from in Homer. What have I gotten myself into? Cedar, get your birthday it is today. Oh, it's uh, it's cool tastes. I was born in 1999, so get on it. Uh, 1999. I'm 21. I'm gonna be drinking this year, Cedar. Oh wow! Uh, are you excited you? to have your first drink? Uh. I I think you gotta lay yourself out here, and me and you're gonna go to the G. You can do my bar. You and me, yes. It's it's gonna be really uh, nice. We can go to the dance club. I don't know if you saw all the great people dancing. I'm sure they'd love to have you. Either I'm blind. I can't see anybody. <laughs> but I'll when you come down here, Senior, we and you are gonna go into the CY bar together. We're gonna live we're it gonna up. We're gonna try to. We're gonna live it up. Okay. I'm dime. Um, just okay, uh. Take a can I take a caller now, Junior? <laughs> cool right. taste. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I can't. Oh, Junior! Don't, don't hurt any more kitties, okay? Junior! Yes? Hey, can I... Junior, we gotta work on this. I'm gonna be yes. able to take some calls. We'll, we'll make it happen. I'll, we'll, uh, we'll use Skype or something. We'll, we'll conference it up. Google we Hangouts. We gotta work on this. Yes, it's yes. Not, it's not... Call the Caesar Robot and Cool Taste podcast for a reason. Okay, it's it's the, the Cool Taste and Caesar Robot podcast. Remember, it's uh, cool we taste had a long Caesar talk. Robot. We had a long talk off uh, off stream. Um, We've dedicated partners. Yeah, I yes, haven't done yes. any podcast because I'm dedicated, Caesar. Yes, you have demonstrated that with the get, calls and. Um, don't let me down. Torment. Don't let me down, DJ. Uh, wouldn't dream of it. Okay, DJ. I'll call you again in about an hour. Understood. Okay. All right. Bye, DJ. Oh, uh, goodbye, cool taste. Fuck.
Yes. Oh, howdy. Hello. Oh, hey. How you doing? <laughs> um, you know, uh, been better. Oh, that's no good. I was actually expecting to get through. I was kind of falling asleep trying to oh. fall in here. Yeah. Um, yes. Sorry about that. No, um, don't worry. Don't sweat it. Anyway, one thing on my mind. Why does everyone give so much hate to our homeboy Dave? Everybody calls him a homeless, crack-smoking drug dealer. I think he's just a lonely old man Well, who just wants some company. I think we should observe his prefix, down the hill. He is down the hill, Dave. He lives down the hill. I don't know about homeless Dave or uh, old drug addict Dave. Well, no, I if pay you, my if respects. You go, uh, if you, I, yeah, with your little Microsoft screensaver of his face bouncing around, yeah. That is the spirit of Dave looking like Lincoln's ghost protecting our boglum. In Microsoft screensaver form? What is that? No. No, I don't use that. I didn't but even no, do that. that was, and that's Scotty. Yeah, I saw Scott. He's amazing. With okay. big head mode or whatever is going on there. He's got a huge head. Yeah. I don't know why it's so big there. <laughs> it's great. No. I just like to think in heaven everyone has big head mode and Josh would fit right in. That's right. Got the, the DK mode and golden eye. Well, listen. All right. I'm not in the mood. I just had to take a call from Cool Taste. Oh, Ooh. I experienced it. As has been we all haunting me without end. I have to do what he says. And now you're making you should have let me talk to him. Ugh. Believe me, I would if I could. I'm going to work on the technology to make I that wouldn't happen. have been that entertaining we'll anyway. So it would matter. Gonna switch but no, I wasn't talking about you talking shit about Dave. But like uh. you look on the Reddit or comments, everyone always talks shit about Dave. And I think he's just a lonely old man. He even showed up to co smoke a bowl with him that one time. And that's right. Like, who does that? No, no one else shows up to Cobra's house free weed. He was I considerate nobody. enough to whisper. Adam, so that it wouldn't yeah, get into it, the yeah, stream. Yeah, exactly. So He's it wouldn't, nice it wouldn't man. go into the hallway so the neighbors could hear it. He was yeah. like, hey, you want to smoke a bowl? Like, yeah, he's... Yeah. Yeah. I, think, I think he's a top-notch chap as far as, as Cobra's, you know, in Cobra's world. It's about he's, as good as he's going to get right now. Lately, yeah. Uh, one of the better influences. Let's hope. Um, or or one day he's just gonna murder him and I'll be kind of a completely wrong. Like Cobra's lips are gonna be part of a lampshade or something. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. He's gonna end up freaking out. Well murdering Cobra and fucking his corpse or something. I don't know. Man, I'm 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 sad now. Making fun of my making fun of my video. Of what Microsoft screensaver come in here? Oh, it is. Come on, say you I'm, saw it. You say made I'm it. Working come on, with that. I didn't make it. It's what's really happening. I'm mad at oh, you. Oh yeah, that's I'm right. mad at you. Yeah, that we've lost sight of the, the issue. I don't talk to you anymore. anymore. I don't want to stream anymore. I'm not gonna do this. Oh well, you you can hang up on me, but keep streaming. I'll stream talk it. about. We we need you. Uh, talk to cool taste and take his abuse, and then you come in here talking about. Screen savers? I'm sick of it. Me with respect. I just want to say, cool taste sounds like a bitch. He said it, not me. I didn't say that. Yeah. Well, you you want to make fun of me too? Thank you. No. Oh. Yes. Thanks for answering my call again, TJ. Oh, anytime, cool days. Anything you want. <laughs> yeah. Wait, is this not cool taste? This isn't. Oh, you had me fooled. 
You no, sounded just like him. No. But, uh, Hear that voice. Chill goes down my spine. You don't understand what it's like. <laughs> I can get, I get the vibes through the cast. I can, I can, I got a feeling, an inkling. Yeah. Blowing up my phone. Yeah. Sending me messages. Sending me all kinds of communication. You don't know what it's like to have them on you. It's a curse. It's like every time he calls. He's a hungry ghoul. <laughs> <laughs> you like yeah. that Chauncey laugh? Yeah. That's a that's a good Chauncey laugh. That was really good. Damn. You don't have like a, a yak pack in your pocket, do you? It's not 1993 anymore. Yeah. It's just like you, you had that clip ready to go. No, man. That's 100% authentic right there. Now that is uh, one hell of an impression. Many we, need, we, need that. we need that for a contest. Chauncey. episodes. Yeah, he's a Chauncey. Oh, Chauncey's listening. Love you, Chauncey. He's like uh, oh. Attitude Costello. Yeah. But um, Dream Team. It's just, uh, I love the way he just kind of builds up when you guys talk about Cobra. Just and he, he gets too excited and he just kind of like boils over like a tea kettle. He does. He, he erupts. <laughs> it finally all comes out. Yeah, <laughs> like a pressure right cooker. <laughs> Builds it up. Man, yeah. Point ketchup all over. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. You've got it nailed. Yeah, uh, man. Yeah. I, I, I think I feel ashamed to listen to much of Snake Bones if I have. Oh, there's nothing A-plus wrong with A-plus content. That. Oh, Snake Bones. I I am always grateful to hear people listen to it, sometimes even more than once. Can you believe that? I, I, you know what? I think I've been guilty of listening. Ugh. Ugh. I think I've been listen, guilty of listening to uh, the Clint monologue. More than once. Oh, uh, the Clint Terminals. Yeah, yeah. It's like, oh, uh, it really got dark there for a minute. Yeah, yeah. Those are fun. Um, cool. I've had that Final on. Fantasy X. Yeah. Background music. Yeah. <laughs> that was fun to use. Plus the, the whole um, kind of like Resident Evil intro was really, really fun. I think the next one's going to yeah, be Yeah, I think it was better. like four. Right? Something like, yeah, there was actually oh, like a... A, a breaker switch that was just directly from one of the recent Resident Evils. Yeah. Dear God. Yeah. Well, uh, Anyways. Keep up I, that Chauncey impression. Ever mentioned yet. Yeah. yeah. I will, but I don't know if anyone's ever mentioned uh, Josh's new little ring that he likes to clink on that glass. Oh, God. Yes. It's like the equivalent of like a comedic snare roll. He just wants to hit those sitting there being the uh, <laughs> philosopher that he is. It's just like you a just high hat. Points home. Yeah. Yeah. It's like, ah, ah, but like, clink. Yeah. <laughs> it's driving girls people use nuts. their bodies and do with men or whatever, and you, you know, whatever fucking rant he's on it. Clink. And, yep. I, and I liked it in the beginning, but now it's like, it's it's like, constant. He, he does it to not just punctuate a point, but just to make noise. He's always bopping that thing. I think it might be a little sensory for him too, with a little artistic yes. rhythm. Yes. In. It's um. Little... Some people call it stimming. For whatever reason, I don't like that term, but uh, just kind of a weird habit that he likes. It uh, feels good for him. But, yeah. He just hits that point home, but yeah. I don't uh, know. I think he's yeah, he's gone overboard with it. Glass tap and awareness. Hey, I, I was thinking about getting the ring just for myself so I could start doing it too. Start start banging on that glass. Potion time. Yeah. Be just like our Dark Lord. <laughs> Jeez. That's so good. <laughs> Love you, Sean. You listening. Well, I'm sure he loves you too. Extra crispy. He's out. Oh, all right. I know it's going to be 30 minutes. We already went past 20 minutes. We'll do four hours. That might be the happy uh, amount. Six drumsticks. Extra crispy. Extra crispy. Extra crispy.
Second time tonight, homie. Yo. Just wanted to ask a quick question and also just say say hello again. And I'm I see that our boys' uh, condition has not improved, and in many ways, it may very well be worse. He's in bad shape. I don't know if he's going to wake up from this one. Yeah, it might not. It might not be today. We might have to check in with him next call-in stream. Yeah. So I uh, just wanted to ask you real quick, bud. Uh, uni, uh, I, there was a bit of like confusion about what the email address was, the correct email address last week. I think I got the right one, though. Basically just sent you some interesting details uh, about, because I, I asked you last week about uh, a possible Josh and Anger 2 stream that you could do with somebody. Mm. And I sent you some details that I figured would be pretty interesting. Not sure if I got that to the right inbox or whatever, uh, but I just figured it would be cool to touch base about that. Yeah. No, uh, let's see here. I do see Josh and Anger 2 here. I need to uh, I need to be a lot better about responding to emails. They have been uh, it's piling right, man. You're in. very busy putting circles of protection on on the trolls to pre- oh, yes. prevent us from having job. things fall off. Yeah. Yeah, it's, you know, you know, if it, you're you're you are the gate. You are the moat that prevents things from falling off of us from cobra's Your indelible dog, magic. Your hair, your teeth, they're all ready to fall off. Yeah, there's it's it's you it's a, a it's a tightrope walk. We are we are playing with fire. By, got the by green being flame. a part of this, yes, the green flame, yeah, exactly. Yeah. You know, the green, the green flame with with black firewood. It starts with wanker scabs, and then the dick rot yeah. sets in, and then it falls off. It gets oh, it gets oh, it's terrible, it's quick, it's terrible. Yeah, you know, I've seen, I've seen, I've seen victims of Cobra. You know, I've seen him. He waves his wand and he says, "A curse." I wish your, you know, their dick to fall off. And then they walk down the street, and then, like, you know, you just hear a little ways down the street, you hear, fuck, I, my dick fell off. My dick fell off. Go swiggity swoodle. Your dick is a noodle. And it turns into fuck, pasta. Fuck, my dick fell off. Yeah. You know, I, you know and, you know, it, 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 even Cobra even got me once. I, you know, oh. I just, one time I got in a car accident, and I was just like, fuck, I got in a car accident, I loudly proclaimed. Yes. I just said it out loud. Yeah, I said it just like that. I said, fuck, I just got in a car accident. That goth bad boy knows real magic. Oh, God damn it, my dick is al dente. <laughs> it's just a big wet noodle now. My little bite it's a to fucking, it. It's a, it's a fucking noodle. Oh, I don't, I don't, I don't think we want to, anybody wants to be taking a bite out of that. Uh-uh. No, watch out. Don't no, mess sir. with me. Our, our Lord is sleeping yeah, but, now, but he'll be back with a vengeance. So be careful what uh, you say. He, He's I mean, listening. He, he, he will be. No, I'm. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not trying to. I'm not trying to to anger our, our 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 goth savior here. No, wouldn't dream of it. Yeah. He no. Once he, up, uh, he will yeah. you. He will curse you. Yeah. When he when he arises, well, I think when he arises, he's gonna need one or two or several beers. Yeah. As so long as he's so gone, but I, I drink. So I got a. I got a. I got a. I got a very serious question here for you, bud. Mm. If Say, say you had a wife, right? I'm not sure if you're married or not. No, no, none of my concern. But say you had one. And she asked you about, you know, she'd said, you'd look sexier with a six pack. What would be your response? Um, I would just try really hard to get uh, a nice six pack abs. Uh, I honestly wouldn't mind. Uh, so, so your response wouldn't be to go to the convenience store pick up a six pack of beer and say, am I sexy now to her? Oh, now that is funny. Uh, I know. It's so I funny. I will say it again. Yeah. I will say it again next week in the next calling stream. Oh, perfect. Cause uh, we need a reminder. This, yeah. Just to, just to remind you that this joke is always there. It's, it's always, always readily there. available. You can fall back on it. If there's like a, like a, a, like dry point in a call or some dead air, you can just tell that joke, pick things right back up. Ow. Yeah. Yeah. Josh loves to tell that one. He also loves to tell that one about that. 
assholes with no lives whenever he's got Sean out. Yeah, work at a funeral home. Yeah. Yeah, always well, always he's working in a funeral home. Mm-hmm. You know, I remember the first time I started watching Josh, you know, the first time he broke out Sean and made that joke, I said, you know, I said, "Hey, that's pretty clever." And then it dawned on me after watching Josh for like a year that that's the only joke Sean has. That's all of them. Yeah. That's it. Yeah, that's, that's it. it. That's that's it. Nice with no lives. Hey, um yeah. You know my um Someone told me once I should get um, six six abs, and um, I bought beer. Oh yeah, uh, there were six of them. Wow! Whoa! Whoa! Did you did you drink all of them? Yes. It's pretty funny, huh? Did you also did you also did you also eat twelve eggs? Yes. Did I did I not tell the joke right? I I, I don't I don't know, man. I think man, you know when Josh when Josh wakes up, I'm sure he'll give us a refresher on what that how that joke goes. Okay, good, good. I'm I'm gonna bone up on that one too. I don't think I told it. Yeah, right. you, yeah. We need the we need the Gothic King to to remind us. Only he can do it. All right, well, I'll study up on it. I yeah we we got some research to do. All right. Well, friend. Give me some time. Real talk. Um, it is backed up when it comes to the podcast. It is backed up with. Oh, I'm certain. I'm not. You know, I'm not trying to put the screws to you, man. I'm not trying to pressure you. I just think it's been a. You know, it's been two years since you covered that topic last, and I think yeah. that's probably one of the most interesting topics there could be for Josh right now because yeah. he. I remember at the time when you first when you did the pilot when you did the the podcast that episode you're, you you were like you know and i forget who the guest was at the time you guys were like oh no he's he's getting better he's he's, he was he's going doing okay now spell uh, of being calm how about. fucking wrong you were how fucking wrong Dead you wrong. were big mistake big mistake no yeah. it's no, yeah we'll, it's, we'll get on that for sure he's, I, yeah i you know and i and some of the yeah some of the stuff i put in there you know it's just like i think part of it's like the 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 dry spell obviously I think is a big contributor. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, he's you know he's uh, obviously he's he's uh, full on you know he's huffing the copium day by day just being like you know sex is a want not a need. What I find interesting though is he's picky at the same time while he's also being angry and frustrated about the dry spell. You know he, I mean and obviously you know fuck the forbidden four you know. Read the fucking room, all right? You have reached. Yes. Yo. What is good? Man, I just what is up with that damn effect he has that is stuck on flange on every all his guitar playing. It's a preset effect on his amp. He just will not take it off. <laughs> it's just a preset. It's kind of like if you have like a, a keyboard and you, you just uh, mm-hmm. hit one of those buttons, gives you a nice little melody that it plays on right. its own. Yeah, dude needs to take that off, man. <laughs> so when he shreds, that's just a like a little pedal button that you can hit and it goes. Yeah, it's like on his amp. Oh man, he's yeah, a, he's a big foamy, like isn't it, he? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't I don't know if I'd call him a phony. He's a he's a virtue a shredder, but you know. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, how did you how did you recognize this? Uh, you pretty good with the guitar. Uh, uh, not like Coke. I used to play back in the day. I, I'm not 
I ain't played in years, but yeah, it's a uh, uh, you get you can get some amp amps will have like a a model on them, and there's like pre of pre like twenty different pre pre of programmed effects on it. You can just turn the knob and <laughs> have a sweep and shit. But yeah, that's why it keeps going in and out. Oh, it's called a flange. Yeah, a flange. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> that's uh. I just I wish he'd take it off. <laughs> <laughs> get the full the full guitar playing we're missing out we're being denied <laughs> the whole experience that we are that we are yeah yeah all right you uh well, hell yeah man i uh, think i could uh come visit you at the uh, guitar center sometime soon you have to do that we'll have to we'll set a little band up in there get oh, called yeah. to sing we'll do some uh some busking for money mm-hmm. yeah uh, my- other other thing that trips me out, dude, the shit he spends money on with the damn Grubhub and all that stuff, yeah, it blows my blows my mind out the door. Dude ain't got two nickels to rub together, but <laughs> yeah, needs to spend his money yeah. more wisely. That would be uh, a wise decision. You got to tell him or, or uh, instruct him, teach him a thing or two <laughs> about guitar playing. Yeah. How to finger a fretboard. Man, board. much love, y'all. You have a good evening, man. I'm going to get Danny Filth to give me a shout out. Oh, yeah. Danny, if you're in here, uh, what do you call yourself? Uh, Jason. Jason. Danny, please give Jason a shout out. Jason from the Guitar Center. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Good to have you, Jason. It was a pleasure talking with you. Good, sir. My yeah, name. man. Peace. Yes. Hey, how you doing there, fella? Oh, I'm well, thank you. Hey, so I need your advice. I'm sorry, I'm from Philly. I'm uh-huh. like a pizza guy. Oh yeah, from Philly. Yeah. Can you give me some advice, please? Uh, is it about foot long hot dogs? No, 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 sir. No. Oh, okay. Okay. Well, uh, I don't know if I'll be able to help you, but go ahead. Okay, so um, I dude, I'm from Philly. I'm a Philly guy, but I, I do wear a cowboy hat, but I don't wear cowboy clothes. And so, like, I'm at a bar right now, and yeah. everyone is is like making fun of my cowboy hat. If there was this other guy who had the cowboy hat, dude, he's making fun of my cowboy hat. What do I do? Oh, you need to square up. There can only be one. Oh, there can, I can only square be band. one. No, oh, Highlander, dude. Yeah. Yeah. So, no, what, no, please actually give me real advice. I don't know what to do. I'm wearing this cowboy hat, and how do I compete with a guy who has a cowboy hat, but his might be better? I don't know. But I, I don't wear cowboy hats normally. I'm just serious, trying to do it like tonight, question. just like style. You may be a resident yeah, I'm sorry. of Philly, but your, your hat, does it have uh, crocodile teeth all around it? No, sir. No, no. I'm not Crocodile Dundee, baby. Okay, I'm just okay. doing it. Okay. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Uh, what's your What's your strongest... Uh, well, you need real advice. Okay. You don't want to commit to violence, apparently. But he's making no, I will hat. not do that. Yeah, well, I, everyone is. There's, like, ladies who are, like, surrounded. I, I had to go in the corner now because uh, I was watching, like, your, like, uh, live stream, you know? Yeah. I had to go to the corner. yeah. And uh, and just like talk to you about my cowboy. I've been calling for like an hour, dude. I know what to uh, do. I don't know. You need what, to go. What? You need to saddle up to the uh, karaoke stand, whatever they call it, yeah. stage. And you need to belt out some Johnny Cash. Okay. That now, well, will win I their can't hearts. do that. Do Do you think so? Yes. Yes. But I but I have to read the lyrics off the screen. And I'm already like a couple shots deep, so I don't know if I can really do that, dude. I'll just make it up as you go. Uh, our Lord does it all the time. He does great. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, yes, yeah. yes. Much love. You like the Bible? The Bible. <laughs> the, the do Bible. you like the Bible? You said do as our Lord does. Oh no, no. I, I'm talking about our Dark Lord, 
uh, King Cobra. Oh, JFS. yeah, Satan. No, he was still in the Bible. <laughs> he was a good guy in the Bible. Well, he wasn't a good guy, but, you know, he's an angel put off from heaven. So maybe I should uh, forgive Satan and then, like, try to, try, like, talk to these people. He'll give you the gift. Something? He'll oh. give you the dark gift to sing okay. Johnny Cash. I got a second. Yeah, yeah. I got a second question, if that's okay. Is that okay? Yes. yes. All right. So I was on a date with a lady earlier tonight. Mm. I do not want children. Um, and But she told me, despite my cowboy hat, that she does want children. Uh, so I lied. And I said that I have a child. And oh. I know a place to hire midgets, but I don't want to, because they're older. They, they'll know that they look older. So I don't hire midgets, right? Lord. So she said she wanted children, and you took yeah. that as yes, you, you need to have children already. I I know. I know. I fucked up. I there don't, may have I been a misunderstanding. There may be, did you already she tell left. her? I mean, that, she left. Okay, okay. Sorry, I, uh, sorry, didn't mean to cut you off. No, you're good. I I think um I think she wants your seed is what she's trying to communicate. Don't don't worry about that story you told her. Just uh tell her that she misunderstood yeah. the gaslighter. Well, how do I fix it now? I've already lied to her, so I, I I will not hire a midget. That is correct, right? Um say that he died. What? <laughs> Lord. All right. I think that's it. Always and on a high note. Well, we got a call here. Caller, you're the last one. You are the last of the callers, friend. Oh, I can hear myself. Hey. A speakerphone that's underwater inside of a dishwasher. Someone's there. They're listening to me. Yeah. I'm going to stink her. I'll try one more. That doesn't count. It's not a real call. You're not a real caller. Counting down. <clears throat> Few minutes. You are the last of the callers. Who is this? How is he? He's hanging in there. He's hanging in there. No. I know. No. I know. I'm heartbroken no, no, no. over it. Don't do it, Cobra. Cobra's in a coma. He no. he doesn't appear to be waking up, but uh, maybe by next week we'll see what happens. Cobra, when... we we can do this, Cobra. We I'll take you out hog thing. hunting. Hog hunting, yeah, yeah. He we'll loves that. Hogs, Nothing like fat women. Oh, pig chase. I love me some fat women. Yeah, that's I mean, right. I'm, I'm happy I finally got through. You know, pork some butts. Yeah, yeah. You're you're pretty lucky. You uh you made it in, bro. Last goddamn call. I've called a, a hundred times. Mm. <laughs> yeah. No. I'm it's not... um. It's got to be frustrating when uh, things are aren't panning out, and uh, you you want to get in there and shoot your shot on that wild pig. Bro, I, I've got like a serial killer uh, letter in front of me. Shit, I've been writing down since the beginning of the night that I want to ask you. Okay. But, uh, let's hear it, man. If, if, uh, this, this time is yours. If you got questions, I'll answer them. First one is that, have you ever been hog hunting with your buddies? I haven't. Now are we talking about actual buddies? pigs or, or, or finding some heavy set women to, uh, make relations heavy set with? women. Oh no. no, no, no. <laughs> I love that you asked that girl, uh, how big a girl are you? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> No, man, I want to take Cobra hog hunting, man, since he has a four-year dry spell. Uh, get a couple of buddies, get some big old women, take them to the bar. <laughs> and uh, How big are we talking about? Yeah, I'm talk like, the bigger the better, you know? Yeah. And then uh, by the end of the night, you take them home. You know, the, the goal is to, 
to have sexual relations and uh you know once you're having sexual relations in the room your buddies bust in and start oinking and uh oh. <laughs> do you guys do the, the goal the is, call like the suey noise oh yeah yeah and yeah. the goal the goal is to uh embarrass her where she uh starts crying and runs out oh man that is that's cruelty to animals friend <laughs> that's not hey i nice. have so i've got so many things to ask you man oh hey first of all hey you that nigga bro i i, I really uh like your uh content man mm-hmm. and uh you're you're like the Joe Rogan of the Boglum, uh, you know, experience. Oh, thank you, thank you. Well, I like to, I, I like I that like... previous sentiment as well. I, I liked that other one too. Hell yeah, yeah bro. Yeah. And uh, shit. Let's see. Hey, hey, can I read up some stuff? And uh, don't hang up on me because uh, I'm gonna be sad. Like you know how everyone else is like, uh, feel free to cut me off. Nah, fuck all that. Uh, stay on the line with me, please. I'm with you. Okay, okay. Um, okay, uh, first thing is, let's see, I, I have a fucking thing of notes. Like, I made those eggs the other day uh, that, uh, you know, Cobra, and uh, they tasted like shit. Um, yes. My, my girl was in a culinary, and so I was like, I'm making these Cobra eggs, right? And she's like, I insist that you don't copy his uh, recipe. But uh, I just wanted to let people know that, you know, I, I would be honest if those things tasted good. They tasted like shit. And he made it seem like they were delicious. The deep fried eggs? Yeah. Oh. Those were, <laughs> I, I would be 100%. They look beautiful when I finish them. They tasted just like a burnt egg because you just fry it again. Yeah, yeah. No, he, um, he makes it sound like it's amazing, but he's just the tiniest bit biased. Hey, what's up with y'all's uh, dream combo? You and uh, Chauncey, that dream yeah. combo thing. Are... It's coming. It's coming. We got to yeah, allocate all the different materials. There's going to be a podcast about uh, Cobra and drinks, and then there's going to be a live stream where we're sampling all the different combinations. That's what's up, man. I had that same uh, that same idea, and then I heard you say it the other day, but with like the food recipes, you know, just like copy a Cobra food recipe and then have a taste test. Uh, like for a YouTube channel, but if you, um, you know. haven't seen them already, uh, should I series tries out a lot oh, of Cobra I... recipes and oh, that's you might be up, able to get man. your fix from that. It's pretty good. Hell yeah. Yeah. Can, is there anything that you, uh, like some secret I, I've been into Cobra maybe like two years. So I, I feel like I'm young, you know, but like, you know, I'm a, uh, he's like, you know, destroying my life. Uh, you know, uh, in with his influences, it, but is there anything that, uh, you know, any secret, like new Cobra shit that I might, uh, not be aware of? Um, have you checked out lolcowgo.net? No, I, ha- I have not. If you visit there, it's a search engine where you can find, uh, Cobra videos. Basically it's transcribed them. So if you put in keywords, you get curious about something. You can put in the phrase or the keyword, and it will show you the video and the timestamp. Uh, very useful. If you've ever wondered, like, has he eaten this or talked about this? Uh, chances are he <laughs> has. Uh, very useful. <laughs> That's what's up, man. Uh, dude, you got the like the most comforting voice. Just I, I enjoy just watching your uh, YouTube videos. You just sound like a cool ass nigga, man. You know. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Thanks. But, Thanks. I'm telling you, dude, you could be like the, the fucking Rogan of the the damn uh, delinquents. Give me time. Give me time. Just got to keep working hard. <laughs> Hell yeah. Work, work on that voice some more. Yeah. Yes, yeah. sir. Yeah. Hey, uh, Felicia's a little snack, bro. Yeah. It's a tasty treat. Yes, sir. Was that on your list? <laughs> the Felicia thing? Yeah, I'm just, <laughs> I'm just reading off shit on my list, man. I, right. Hey, the truth is, I was getting blizzastered uh, writing this list down, and I've had about ten uh, Mountain Dew uh, wines, and I'm I'm pretty tooted up. Oh, yeah, man, tooted up. Was it the? Uh, yeah. It's not that new seltzer they came out with, is it? Like the White Claw, but Mountain Dew. Oh, bro, I've never had a White Claw in my life. I'm too manly, right? Have you? No. 
I, I'm not opposed to them. Shit, I just, you know. No, Mountain I, Dew is uh, coming out with um, an actual alcoholic beverage. It's like White Claw, but uh, Mountain Dew flavor. I wasn't sure if that'd come out yet. That's what's up. Yeah. Hey, Caesar, have you seen that uh, To Catch a Predator where Cobra's watching uh, To Catch a Predator, I think, with Mr. Green? Yeah, yeah. And, uh, dude, do you see how his eyes are lighting up during this, uh, you know, um, the series? Like, it's very telling. Well, he's watching something other than his uh, garbage. I don't even know what you call those channels. The entities that talk about social issues and stuff. Uh, something that's actually entertaining. So, yeah, he was real fixated. Also, he hates, um, he hates those chomos. Do you believe that? That he hates them? Yeah. Um, yes. Uh, I think he is terrified of ever being identified as one. Not so much because right. he's kind of concealing that uh, desire for small children, but because that's just like a really heinous <laughs> thing to be. So he must always project <laughs> that he's not that thing <laughs> at all times. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Um, man, I'm a Cobra. Like, I'm one of the good Cobra dudes. I, like... I don't get the Cobra hate, man. Like I, I, uh, I love the guy really, you know. And he's, uh, he's all right. He, he, um, he was more lovable in his younger years, but these days he's kind of detestable. He's, uh, he says some, some pretty stupid things, heinous things. You, you seem like you enjoy Cobra, like, and you're not too hard on him. Is that right, or? I try to see both sides of things, but lately I've had to acknowledge that uh, he has become incredibly dislikable. In his early years, especially people who are watching his um, really early videos in the basement, uh, they're, they're saying, like, this is actually a charismatic young person who could potentially grow out of this. And um, that was the first impression that was set and kind of lingered with me for a long time. Um, uh, and now I'm really reconciling that he is not that boy anymore. He's just a piece of crap. I kind of see him like, uh, you know how Kanye, like Kanye just has mental issues and, but he does have like these great qualities. And so like, that's how I've been viewing Cobra is like, yeah, like he, you know, everyone's got these, you know, terrible, like bad qualities, but you know, I see the positive in, in him. I, I, uh, have a Cobra fan thing on TikTok. Do you do you get on TikTok much? Nope. You don't, dude. He's you know he's got shit quite a few like fan pages on TikTok. That that's actually the first place I ever saw him was a uh, a clip of him like that clip where he's like uh, talking about how uh, he's. So. That's going to do it for tonight. Serious question. Um, man. I don't know where to begin with that. Uh, the battle strategy going forward might be, I'm going to assume that you are trolling me or something. Uh, I have a list, and no way are you going to hang up on me. There's a Venn diagram, there's kind of a compromise I want to meet of allowing people to talk, but are you on TikTok? I've got a Cobra TikTok. Nice guy, listen, I'm not mad at the guy necessarily. I just don't always understand the filibustering. So, uh, we're going to continue, not tonight, but going forward. We're going to keep doing live streams, keep doing call-ins. But if you come in and you're just there to talk for 20 minutes or whatever, I'm going to flush you. You got to go. Got to keep it moving. Uh, re seriously, some people have just got to be trolling me. Anyway, chat, it's been real. Thank you for your patience. Uh, about ready to about ready to go off on a real rant. Um, 
it is very difficult for me to disappoint people. And that's where I have to do it sometimes. So. <laughs> I, uh, I just don't know what to do in that kind of situation. You are there to stay as long as possible, and you've made your intentions clear. You're there to stay as long as possible. I don't want to be a mean guy, and but let's face it, we're here to entertain. We're here to have fun, whatever. So just don't, like, come with the message and say it, and then, like, let someone else come in. Anyway. Sour note. Sour. Sour. Note to end on. Next week, we're going to uh, have the Valentine stream. It's going to be awesome. Please look forward to that. It's been, uh, it's been real, guys. Uh, Valentine stream is going to be super fun. Little Nepotiz gave a $2 dono, said you're a cold G seizure. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, sometimes you, you just have to, like, you just have to go. Just have to say bye bye. Jesus. I'll say one more thing, because I'm, I'm a little pissed. I'm a little pissed off. Uh, <laughs> no, I'm not. I'm not. P just, just please observe. Uh, oh, man. If I have an emergency and say, please uh, understand if I don't respond to your messages, don't keep emailing me with your ideas. <laughs>